How's it going everybody? God right here. Once again, thank you for clicking into one of my videos even though it is going to be a live stream. Let me go ahead and click the correct tab here so you guys can see this. We'll go ahead and click extras and go to the My Fighters. We do have six members, which of course is my guy. We are in the heavyweight division for you that are already members. You already know, which is God Bear. We have Asante Beast. We have Mr. Hit Hard. We have Dragon Elite, Dondre Welch, and Sean Mafia. So the six of us are gonna have at least one fight. And of course, if any of the fighters do have two fights, everybody's got to have two fights and that's going to give us 12 total fights 12 total fights i mean six total fights because there's six of us and of course we have to match up against each other and i do also have a bet system going on or a currency it is hash not hashtag exclamation mark points for you that are curious about that and of course once we get some actual currency built up we will be able to go ahead and bet those on the fighters but first i have to figure out how to give you guys actual coins to actually bet so we don't have to watch for an hour and then finally have something to bet which of course is going to be the second video and what's going on punch welcome to the stream glad you're here we can actually get you created and uh first off um I'll, i just went over the fighters what's going on preston but uh, we do have fighters here, and first I do want to go over the rules. I have them here, and you will be able to challenge your opponents or have a fight randomly selected to you. And of course, by winning a fight, you will instantly level up, and amongst leveling up, which will reward you with five attribute points, you will be able to choose a perk and a move. So you can choose a perk, which is, you know, for example, stunning an opponent by 10%, and that's level 1. And you can improve that more and more each time you level up. Or you can also choose a move like Flying Knee, or a Superman Punch, or a Overhand Hook, or something like that. And if you lose a fight, you get half a level, so if you get two losses, you grow a level, and it's like that. And Hyper, we can also get you created first, but we're going to go over the six fighters we have currently created we'll go through mine first we'll go through appearance i'll show you that i only have two tattoos i'll get closer here you see that one is on my right shoulder and then i do have one on my left forearm it's just kind of a red theme even though you know there are no real good green colors especially lime green lime green doesn't really look good on skin so there's no tattoos of my channel color. So this is me. I do have green eyes. Um, if you can see that a little bit, we're not gonna go ahead and look at that, but just quickly, I'm gonna show you there. We will go to skills, I'll show you my stats and what my fighter is. I have fast striking, good hit power, a little bit of accuracy, and a little bit of footwork, which is, of course is movement speed. Other than that, everything is, is at 30. I have zero in my I guess my toughness traits so I'm probably gonna get knocked out really easy but my whole game plan is to try to knock you out before you, you knock me out and if we last to the later rounds I have strike and endurance stamina to be able to outlast you if we make it any further than the first second third round and that of course is my fighter so we're gonna go ahead and exit move on to the second fighter and a hyphy and punch uh, I don't think I actually I'm going to qu quickly confirm as I click Asante Beast. I want to double check to see if the player creation application is in the comment section. So you guys can see. All right, so yes, the player creation application is in the description. If you guys kind of want to paste that in the chat and we can get you created as well. And really quickly, you see that Asante Beast has rostered reds, he's got a big beard, and he's got two full arm sleeves on both of his arms. No tattoos on the back, and neither did my fighter. And then for his style, not personality, it's skills, you see that he's got good speed, full power, and then he's all about trying to stay on his feet and not get knocked out. So he's, of course, going to be a little bit of a handle with that power. You're going to want to make sure that he doesn't make contact with you. Ooh, there's Hyphy with his fighter. 
and uh, I forgot to put in the description or at least update it um, the height is anywhere between 510 and 66 weight is 206 and 265 and here is my nephew's fighter right here of course he is all decked out in tattoos all across his body with that blue hair he also has blue eyes he's got tattoos on his legs and then his skills are not too fast besides being able to stay on top of you with his movement speed and then once again we have a fighter with a hundred hit power so you're gonna have to watch out for that and then his toughness is once again gonna be able to keep him on his feet he's gonna send it to me as a message that works as well I'm gonna try to quickly go through these ones so we can get to the new fighters and then go ahead and get to the point that we all want to see in the actual fights And now appearance tattoos he has no tattoos but dragon elite is just a clean body no tattoos but you see he is pretty muscle bound and that's just going to give you a hint of how he's going to be built a little bit faster than the last couple fighters besides my own he's got good hit power he's got good blocking his footwork is probably the least out of everybody but he can of course lay you out and he's one of the most accurate out of everybody and then once again we have a I guess a system going where people are going to be hard to knock or hard to be knocked out besides my own fighters. So hopefully, you know, that pans out for me. I'm not sure if it's going to or not. I have not tested any of these. We're all going to have to figure out, you know, what works <laughs> for ourselves. So if you happen to have a good build, you know, good for you. But what's the height and weight? So height is anywhere between 510 and 66. Weight is 206 and 265. So any be anywhere between those two. Now, Dondre Welch, you see, uh, one thing I will say I don't like about this UFC game is all of the light skin tones are trash. Like, it's either really white, it's a yellow tint, or, you know, you start being a different ethnicity and you're no longer white. And uh, he does have, you know, you see a single sleeve tattoo, but I will just, just go over through it. You see, right here, super white. You see right here, kind of like a yellow tint to it. Right here, I think, is the only other mediocre color, but it's even more of like a yellow or orange. This one is okay. You're just kind of tan. This one, you're super tan, and then you start being different ethnicities. So you literally have like two colors to choose from that look okay, which is the first one and the fourth one in my opinion, but we we'll are go ahead and getting sidetracked so we'll check out his stats. You see, he is very fast, very accurate, very powerful, and then with a little bit of toughness to him. So Dondra Welch has a pretty good build in my opinion. We'll see if it pans out for him. And we do got a couple more builds to get going and then uh, getting excited. Oh yeah, Preston, I'm hoping that obviously you and me win unless we get matched up against each other. And what are the stats we can put into points in? Um, let me show you uh, when I get to the uh, attributes again. But right here, you just see clean cut, Sean Mafia, blonde hair. He's been in the our leagues before. He's actually rejoining the YTB Madden series. And then skills, we got, so yeah, right here, of course, every attribute starts at 30. And you can put 200 attribute points. That's what we're doing for the UFC because 100, you literally get like only... 70 into like a striking speed and 30 into power that's literally not much so 200 just to build your fighter that much more and you know there's a lot more tribute points that actually make a difference in ufc than there is in the madden series but of course he's pretty balanced in speed power accuracy footwork and then of course a little bit of toughness as well i'm the only one out of all the fighters right now that have nothing in their toughness so hopefully i don't have too much of a glass chin i um, somewhat regretting not putting anything in there, but I'm not going to go ahead and change that at all. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and I need to go ahead and click circle. Go over to create a fighter. Let me check out Hyphy's. Oh, Hyphy did not message me yet. So I'll just go scroll up here. We'll go male fighter. We are in the heavyweight class just so we can have. Oh, yeah. So right here. Um, let's see. You did, oh, what's going on, Sante Beast? I just showed off all the fighters. 
but let me know what kind of fighter you want to be hypey of course there's striker brawler balance grappler and submission so far um me and i believe sean mafia are the only two strikers everybody else is brawlers because they want to go more into the power aspect i went striking because of course i want that strike speed um, none of that really makes a difference too much because we are putting the attributes to whatever category that we want and you have to go soon can you make me first oh yeah okay let me do punch plays first i guess i didn't have to hit circle um so yeah heavyweight punch we'll do you first so which of these categories do you want to be of course, I'm assuming all of us are going to be one of these three, striker, brawler, or balanced. So yeah, Punch, if you just want to let me know in the chat, we'll go ahead and get you started. Uh, it's more of a standard, you know, description of your fighter. Brawler, we got you. And then I'm assuming your name is going to be Punch Plays, so we'll do that once again. And then let me know how tall you want to be, anywhere between 5'10 and 6'6". And then the weight is from 206 to 265. Uh, nickname, I try to go just with P's, you know, or, you know, stick with the same name or same letter of what the name start with. I have commentator sound off anyway, so this really doesn't really make that much of a difference. You won't hear the name at all. But wait, all right, so I already put it, look, oh, you look up, okay, my bad, oh, 66250, I got you, 66250, there we go, and now appearance, we'll just go head, template, uh, I sent info to Facebook, Messenger, oh, I got you, so yeah, face, um, what kind of skin tone do you want to be, because obviously some of these faces, you know, if you want to be stereotypical or you know certain i'll just stick with ethnicities like this one typically probably isn't a white person's face this one uh i guess that's a white person's face uh i'm trying to find one that's different okay like this one these are i guess any face could be white face but you know you never know can i put uh info into my brother yeah we'll do that right now we're currently doing punch plays yeah just let me click into one. you like that one i guess punch just let me know uh, my latency i feel like i got a pretty good you know pretty low so we can uh, respond to each other pretty quick so as soon as you comment it i'll be able to uh you know accept or continue <laughs> through it see ya oh you're leaving oh you have to go now but i put everything oh, okay let me just scroll up real quick then um okay so white body wait body type flabby no tats okay i got you all right so we're just gonna go Let's just pick him a decent face. We'll just go with this one. He said white. So we'll go. We'll make him the tannest version of white. Since I have not chosen that one yet. And uh, give me a second. Because I have to stay scrolled up here. From your guys' comments. Just to get this going. So he's got an epic beard. So we'll go facial hair first. And he wants an epic beard. So that kind of has to be actually that one's kind of epic or this one is epic or we'll give him the big old beard for that one's more epic and then long shorts slow hard hitting and can take a lot of blows got you okay so let's just give him a nice hair do real quick what about this one we'll give him that one for now if he wants a different one we can change it i'm trying to give everybody different eyebrows uh, we got his eyes here. We'll just make them slightly brighter. The body, he said flabby, so let's go full on flabby. And then, other than that, long shorts, and then can take a blow. So I can scroll back down to your guys' comments and everything. He's very flabby. Uh, I do gotta change the hair, body hair, just to this one, because it only leaves it on the forearms and the legs. No chest hair, unless you guys want chest hair, and then of course we can do that. But right now, he said no tats long shorts which is when we got we just got to change the mouth guard to one that seems like punch plays would have that i don't have on ed any of the other fighters yet we'll give him the gold one all right now skills stats uh i gotta run to the store if you need anything just let me a messenger oh, okay sounds good all right so let me knock down these all real quick up a moment just to double check what he said 
So he said, slow, hard hitting, and can take a lot of shots. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to try to just speed run through these guys just to get some fights over with and going. And then if you guys do want anything changed, we'll go over that at the end of the video when we, you know, once again, go to fighters that have grown levels and we can improve you. But again, just trying to quickly go through the character creations. We have two more, two more. Yeah, no, just hyphy. Punch plays is who I'm currently making. All right, so hard hitting. Since he's slow, we might as well give him 100. And he can take a lot of blows. So hold on, let me bring up my calculator on my phone. So we got 200 and that's minus 70 for that. And then we'll give him 80 blocking. So that's minus 60. So he's got 70 left, which has to go into this. So we'll give him 50 there, which is minus 20. We'll give him 20 here, 20 here, and the last 10 we'll put into chin. So he has the best chin out of everybody. And then I have, there are no perks. I do have to remove all of these because I'm removing them. When we do grow a level, like I said, you will be able to equip a move. And when you equip a move, it will be level one. And next time you grow a level, you can either equip another move in one of these other categories or improve the level of that move. Oops, I didn't mean to hit circle. Which I think is gonna be a lot of fun because there's so many different ways and certain, oh my God, stop hitting circle. Because certain people can either do like perks or just get a bunch of moves or make one move really good before going and improving to any other moves. So, Again, I don't know what's going to work in this series or, you know, we'll all find out. And if one dude starts manhandling everybody, we'll just try to replicate what he's been doing. And uh, good luck to everybody. Obviously, I wish the best for my own fighter. But of course, I got to make sure I click into these and nobody gets an advantage. So I gotta make sure everything is empty. Da, 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 da. That's that, combos, nobody. Okay, and that's all I gotta, oh dang it, I forgot about this, these things. Okay, so personality is just the celebration. I'm gonna go to the center because I haven't really selected one from the center. Which one seems like punch plays with lots? I'll just go with this one for now. Posture, oh, uh, let's see. We'll give him that one. Taunt, stance, orthodox. Okay, so we got that. Save. And now we will move to... Thank God the power's back. Oh, God, but you didn't. <laughs> Thank, oh, yeah, I got you. But uh, let me go to Hyphies real quick. And we'll get him created. And then... Oh, Sean Mavi, I actually got you created already. You're already in here. Oh, that's your brother. Okay, yeah, that's your brothers that you're talking about. But yeah, let me get Hyphy created in here. Create a fighter. Wait, can you make my personality like Alexander Gustafson? Yeah, let me do that real quick before I forget. There you are. All right, style, personality. There you go. So you want this guy. And save. Oh, Nate Diaz. Okay, I got you, Hyphy. Ah, right, so yeah, we are going to Hyphy real quick. He, oh, he wants balanced. Okay. Out of uh, the... I guess we'll say archetypes because it's literally only a title because however we build is how we build. That initial choice doesn't make that much of a difference. At least I don't think so. <laughs> Alright, yeah, but we'll definitely try to get everybody going here. So, Hyphy wants to be 6'2", 250. Muscular, like block, 
Oh, Brock Lesnar tattoo, which they don't have, but I will best replicate it for you. I should just keep this on A, or Assassin, because nobody can hear them, but the fact that I've already changed so many... Oh, I didn't do this on the last fighter. Dang it, I'll have to do it for the one I forgot to do. Again, it doesn't really matter, but it's just the fact that I've done it for all the rest of them that I want to now. And, uh, what made you start doing these again? You miss it? I did miss it. Like, it's mainly, like, uploading videos is fun, but just replying to comments... Yes, it's interaction, but it's not a, you know, it's not nearly as satisfying as being able to act or inter interact with you guys consistently throughout an entire stream. It's a lot funner that way. My flipping phone keeps not dying, but you know, black screening, going into rest mode. All right, so sword on chest, lol, I got you. And then, all right, so bald with beard is what hype he wants to be like. 100. Wait, who's the tallest player? Uh, I think I am. I'm 6'6". Six, six. Um, Dragon Elite is 6'5". Uh, I think there's another fighter that's 6'5". The rest are around 6'3", six, 6'2". Six, right, which face does Hyphy get? I'm trying to give everybody different faces. Because I don't want to go through and sculpt them all. Short is the best. Short's going to help you with that hit power because this game has that, you know, little bit of... Uh, Hyphy said Brock Lesnar, so he's going to get a big jawed guy like this thing. We'll give him this one. We'll give him a Brock Lesnar body. Ah, uh, Brock Lesnar body. Let's see. I don't care about face. Okay, I got you, Hyphy. Oh, Dondra, you're also 6'6"? Six, six? That is correct. Yeah, you said 6'7", but I made you 6'6". Six, six. Um, that's pretty close to a Brock Lesnar body. Athletic, but also big. Alright, so hair, you said bald. And with a beard. Hair color doesn't matter if you don't have any. We'll change your eyebrows real quick, just to these ones. Hair color will be brown. Facial hair, you want a beard. What about this beard? That beard looks pretty tough. We'll give you that one. I gotta change body hair because I hate having that chest hair. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but <laughs> yeah, I don't like it. Uh, eyes, uh, Brock Lesnar, I think has blue eyes because he's typically... We'll give you these ones. He's a, he's a blonde haired guy, isn't he? Uh, so tattoos let me give you a sword tattoo uh this is pretty close to a sword tattoo try to do like this with it let me see if there is any better ones the tattoos are kind of lackluster oh no there is an actual sword okay i saw it there's a sword it's right where did that go? I was already on the category. There it is. I don't think it quite reaches his belly button. It's like almost. So you get that. And I do just want to do that. And now we need the big old back tattoo that he has. Uh, wait. Genuinely can't believe so many people are still here from two years ago. Oh yeah. Like I obviously appreciate you guys sticking through. And uh. Let me... Where is the tattoo close to his big old skull tattoo? Probably... This this one? We'll just do this one. I know it's only one side, but we'll make you that much different. We'll just do... Put it right there. There we go. But yeah, just trying to go through these relatively quick. It's crazy to see. It's been two years. Oh, I know. I got... 9% on your phone? Uh-oh, that's not good. <laughs> Alright, so we got the... Oh, fighter gear. Fighter gear, the mouth guard. Uh, I don't know what Brock Lesnar's mouth guard is. We'll just give you the UFC one for now. And then skills. So you want... Oh, points wherever I want. Okay, but you said balanced. Okay, I got you. Alright, so I can close that now. 
But yeah, I am really excited to get these fights going. Like, obviously, we were at six members with Hyphy. It's going to give us eight. And then we are going to have uh, Sean Mafia's brother, Ryan Mafia, as well, which is going to give us nine, which is going to give us an uneven amount, which we'll have to figure out how to get him two fights. Somebody is going to have three fights. So whoever gets three fights might get one the next time we stream. Or we'll see how that works out. Oh, yeah, I actually figured out the betting. I got to figure out a way to actually get you guys some coins now so you can bet versus having you, you know, have to watch for an hour to actually get some points, which is going to be a little annoying. But uh, here, let me open up my calculator again. Type in 200. We're going to give him what? 60 in speed, 60 in power, which of course collectively is minus 60. We're gonna give him 60, 60 accuracy. We'll give him 50 footwork, which is minus 30 and minus 20. So he's got 90 left. We'll give him 50 in blocking, which is again minus 20. Justin says, sign me up. <laughs> gotcha. And I guess. He's only got 20 left, so we'll just go all 50 in chin for now. Oh, and Justin says Brock Lesnar-ish dude, which is what Hyphy did. All right. But yeah, that's going to be Hyphy for now. So, okay, you're pretty balanced in terms of your striking, but you might get knocked out kind of like me. So, hey, we're, we're both in that boat. But uh, let me try to get, wait, who do you want to win tomorrow? I want the Rams to win. Like, I'm not a big fan of Tom Brady. There's a few exception of all-time greats that I enjoy. And it's only if I watched you from the beginning. So, an example. Okay, despite his whole drug use and physically enhancing drugs, like John Jones. Um, he's an all-time great that I've watched since the beginning of his career. So, the fact that he became great, you know, is just circumstance. I watched him from the beginning. I've always liked him, so... Uh, I keep hitting circle. So the fact that he's great, you know, I don't mind it. I watched you get there kind of thing. But Brady, who has been good since I've known him, I don't like guys like that. Like, I didn't like Peyton Manning. He was great since, you know, when I learned about him. Guys like that that are just good from, you know, without me experiencing watching them get good or, you know, go through the struggles or however. Um, not a big fan of guys like that. So, yeah, not a big fan of uh, Tom Brady. <laughs> so I want to see Tom Brady lose. He's that man I think has done enough for his legacy. He doesn't need a gosh darn nether ring. I feel like he's borderline about to, you know. This ring, he's literally going to have to put on his opposite hand. Like, that's annoying. Like, if you already got five rings, you don't need a sixth one. Because then you're going to have to start putting it on your opposite hand. And you might as well eBay those damn rings at that point. It's ridiculous. Alright, so personality. Alright, so my picks would win me a lot of money if I was older. I picked the Falcons before the season. or three years ago. The Eagles before the season last year. And the Rams this year would be, oh, perfect for the season. Alright, did that. Don't disrespect the GOAT Peyton. <laughs> Preston says boo because, unfortunately, he's a... Stupid Patriot fan. No, I'm a Seattle Seahawks fan. Through and through, no matter what happens. But yeah, we need to find Brock Lesnar, which I don't think is in here because he'd be right here. Um, alright, Hyphy. I think I just want to give you Bruce Lee. Why not make you a Brock Lesnar dude with a Bruce Lee bow until you tell me otherwise? Now, posture. Maybe we give you Bruce Lee as well if they don't have Brock Lesnar, which I, he's not in the game anymore. Whoa, there, is there any bees? There's got to be bees. There's only Ben Rothwell. We'll give you the big old Ben Rothwell and stance, all that stuff. We can save. We can move on. Uh, do you think... Wait. What do you think of Sam Darnold? Wait, Sam... Oh, the Jets quarterback. He's all right. Like, I think he's... He reminds me, at least physically, a lot of Andrew Luck. Uh, you know, they got the same build. They're both relatively athletic. Uh, Andrew Luck more so athletic and of course he's been a little bit more proven but I feel like Sam Donald could become another Andrew Luck of course they're gonna have to get him another weapon outside of uh, Robbie Anderson Quincy Anua is all right 
Jason Morrow didn't really pan out, but uh, they're a young team, pretty well rounded with their youth. So it's all about them trying to, uh, you know, do what they can about improving. And now, who do we have next? We got Justin with Roy Nelson. <laughs> but uh, okay, we have trying to scroll through and find these. You guys are hitting up the comment section pretty well. And hold on, how many members do we have right now? All right, my fighters, that gives us eight. That gives us eight. Yeah, God Bear, Asante Beast, Mr. Hit Hard, Dragon Elite, Dondre Welch, Sean Mafia, Punch Plays, and CJ Hyphy. And then we have Ryan Mafia and Justin to create, which is going to give us 10 total members. And that gives us 10 to 20 total fights. All right, so real quick, we're going to go ahead and create Ryan Mafia. You said to do the Mafia as short as possible, but uh, I'll go with... Oh crap, what did you say here? Uh, covered in tattoos, baggy shorts, boxer, purple dread. So boxer, I'm just going to take that as striker. Alright. I'll put Ryan Mafia. Actually, you said the Mafia, fine. We'll just do the Mafia. Fine, I'm not I'm just gonna keep assassin there because you guys won't be able to hear it anyways. You said short as possible and 185 pounds. Oh, can't go down to 185. 206 is the least amount, but we'll put him at that. Oh, oh let me scroll down and see what Justin says. Oh Preston's excited, god, can't wait to fight. Let's fight. Oh I know for sure. Let me I'm gonna try to rush through these ones and get everything created. Uh, what was the skin tone that you said? You said... Uh, okay, you said... Purple dreads and your brother. Baggy shorts. Okay. And covered in tattoos. Okay, black. So we'll go with this one. You said dreads. Style. What kind of dreads? You said roster dreads? Wait, do you want normal dreads or roster dreads? Because there's these roster dreads which Asante Beast has, but there's also these ones that are short and tight. Other than that, you said baggy pants but purple hair. So we can do that. I'd take uh, Andrew Luck. Anything better? Oh, than a bust, right? Okay, yeah. But yeah, we'll change to pur purple. Alright, so we'll go purple. Uh, just let me know if you want, or if your brother wants the roster dreads or these tight dreads. So yeah, those or these. And now that I look at those, I'm assuming, yeah, you're going to say these ones. <laughs> Alright, eyebrows... I'll just stick you with those ones. I don't. Th yeah, I can't change the eyebrow colors. And does he want any facial hair? His facial hair we can change to purple as well. And of course, there's a hand select. I don't know if you want to go funny. If you want a Tony Stark goatee here, or if you want to go a little bit French, or scruffy with a mustache, or a Fu Manchu. That actually looks kind of cool. If you want to be super bizarre and continue up the trend. There's just a straight mustache, Chuck Liddell, uh, just a straight porn stash, or just clean cut. <laughs> so we'll let you decide. No facial hair, got you. Uh, you said covered in tat. I always forget to do the body hair. There we go, covered in tattoos. What kind of tattoos? What do you want the, uh oh crap, I forgot what you said for body style. Just describe me like what kind of tattoos you want, like colorful, um, no color, a certain theme. Uh, that's hyphies. Uh, where is... Oh, where to go? You guys are hitting up the comment section so well. <laughs> it's hard to find these. There he is. Uh, you didn't say any body style. Okay, so what kind of tattoos and what kind of body style? Obviously, there's chubby. There's ripped. There's small gestures just cover him in colorful tats go overboard will do and just let me know what kind of body style you would like obviously there's a lot of them so right now I'll just select this one because he is a smaller size at 206 so we'll give him like a semi athletic body style okay we'll go we'll give him this one this one's pretty built all right and now we'll not skin tattoos all right so just colorful tattoos and we're gonna cover you up 
Mm, all right, so one that's gonna cover your chest. Colorful tattoo, colorful tattoo. You know what, flower, if you got pink hair, we're gonna just give your chest a big old flower tattoo. Now we're gonna cover your back. And uh, once we actually get some fights going at the end, if you guys stick through and you wanna edit your characters to change them and making them look better, we can do that, but I definitely just wanna get some fights going. And, you know, since we got it going, you got a... <laughs> if you got the uh, flower on the front, we're going to give you a fish on the back. I got it charging. Okay, awesome. Yeah, left arm. Let's see here. We'll give you this one because it's nice and dark. It'll stick with the... Uh... Oh, I didn't mean to rotate. Get it to go like that. Go right. I want the eyes. I gotta lower it right there. Right arm. Let's see. I'll give you this purple dragon thing. Gotta get it to rotate all the way around. There we go. Right there. And. Ah, uh, we gotta do your legs. Okay, we'll do your legs just because we have to. Wait, actually, I want to be surprised. Okay, I got you. All right, I'm just trying to clean up or get you all covered. Like that. And we'll do this one over here. There we go. Alright, so this is him. Pretty damn tatted up. Ryan said thanks. Oh yeah, no problem. Obviously this series would be nothing without you guys, so I appreciate you guys, I guess, coming through and creating fighters. Ah, uh, there's no real... You know what? Keep you up with the weird theme. We're going to give you straight teeth. Accessories. Uh, yeah. I'm going to do that just because... It kind of fades away down at your ankles just to make it look a little better just so the tattoo kind of just go behind that and they don't awkwardly fade when they do reach your ankles and then let me know how you want oh Brazil okay I got you let me go back to that real quick uh, let me know Brazil let me know uh, how you want your fighter created of course we'll take these down and we have 200 trivia points I will once again open up my phone Open up my calculator, go 200. If you want to let me know, you know, when he is just like me. Oh, yeah, you guys, I'm going to be excited to uh, have you guys get matched up against each other. If you do eventually fight, I'm assuming all of us will eventually fight one another. It's just a matter of when. Uh, but, uh, yeah, you guys are going to be two just escaped from prison fighters. And uh, instead of being locked up in a cell, you're locked up in an octagon. And only one of you can leave, at least consciously, because you're going to knock each other out. <laughs> uh, he wants to be fast and athletic. I got you. So a little bit of power and athleticism is what I get from that. So we'll make you... Alright, so you said fast. We'll give you 90 my phone wants to go correctly there we go all right so minus 60 will give you footwork at 90 as well which will make you the fastest person you'll be able to stay on top of everybody which is minus 60 so you got 80 left we'll give you a little bit power at 50 which is going to give us minus 20 puts you at 60 uh we'll give you a little bit of accuracy so minus 10 and then 50 we'll put into your chin and everything so we'll go 20 here, 20 here, and 10 here. So hopefully that'll be okay. Uh, moves I gotta take off, I guess, which gives you a window to let me know if you want any of that changed from what I just did. Again, um, just trying to run through these real quick. So if I, you know, go too quickly for you guys, or if you don't want something how I said it, um, again, hopefully you don't mind until we actually get some fights under our belt because I really want to get these things going. I'm excited and highly anticipated to uh, 
see who gets matched up against who because I am going to allow you guys to challenge one another. Dondre Welch ahead of time in our Twitter DMs said he wants to fight me so we're going to make that happen and I hope I can make him regret it and uh, you know I'm hoping I can put his back on the canvas in a very unconscious or wide open stiff armed <laughs> way. Oop, not level 5. How about empty? So if you guys want to go ahead and talk some beef in the chat and stir up some rivalries, you can do that. And uh, the schedule is YTV Madden every Friday and YTV uh, UFC every Saturday. And they're go both going to be streamed at the same time, which is 6 p.m. East or 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. And Ricky... Welcome back, by the way. Been a little bit, but welcome back. But uh, yeah, you can definitely get a fighter. I think I have to scroll down to make sure there's any submissions like that. Rear naked choke. So yeah, we got another fighter, which is going to give us nine, which is ridiculous. And then personality. If you have a favorite fighter, this is where you guys probably want to recommend them because it's their celebration. But just because who you are or what we just made you, we're going to make you Conor McGregor. Actually, Conor, Conor McGregor and Robbie Lawler. Why not? Robbie Lawler, this is his stance. Taunt stance save. All right, so now we've got that going. That gave us eight. And then, yeah, Ricky, I remember you. I believe... Oh, what position were you? I don't think you were in the YTB series. I believe you were in the NBA series, though. But yeah, if you want to, the uh, player creation for you... You want to fight Dondre Welch? Um, he actually called out Dragon Elite as well. Um, if Dragon Elite doesn't join here, I'll let you fight him. But uh, right now, let me confirm that we are at eight fighters, which would mean Ricky is the next. We are at nine fighters. Okay, so Ricky's going to be the 10th one. So hold on. Let me see. I have everybody here. We have me, Asante Beast, Mr. Hit Hard, Dragon Elite, Dondre Welch, Sean Mafia, Punch Play, CJ Hyphy. We have the Mafia. Am I forgetting anybody? I'll fight anyone and kick their... AS with the asterisks replacing it. <laughs> Me, that's a death wish kid. Oh, Dondre's there. But uh, am I forgetting anybody? Oh, Justin. Okay. Ah, okay. Let me see here. We gotta try to get this going. Oh, yeah, we gotta put. We gotta change hyphies real quick to Nate Diaz. Yep, I got you, hyphy. I just read your thing. I'm on my way. <laughs> But, um, yeah, Rick, if you want to go ahead and fill out the player creation application, which is in the description of the stream, we can get you in here. You'll be our 10th fighter. You said Nick Diaz? Uh, you said Nate Diaz. Okay, so Nate Diaz. Taunt. I want posture. We're going to go this way. There's Nate Diaz. There we go. Save. Yeah, Preston, one more fighter. We're going to go at 10 fighters, which is going to give us 10 to 20 total fights for this stream, which is going to be absolutely ridiculous. And we're going to have to find out or come up with who's fighting first. And let me actually test. Um, we'll give Ricky a little bit of time to uh, get our stuff going. Can you make all my stuff like Alexander Gustafson? Yeah, I got you. Um, that is Dondre Welch. I think I just have to change your posture. We have your personality as it, but I did not choose. Yeah, your personality is Alexander Gustafson, but I did not do your posture. And you guys are working up some coins or points, by the way. So if you guys want to do uh, exclamation mark points, there's a few of you with uh, a good amount of points. And there is a level system as well, since we're you know, known for the YTV series. We're going to do the same thing with the stream coins. Um, by reaching a certain amount of coins, we'll be leveling up. So a lot of you or everybody is level 2 currently. There is certain milestones you reach to grow another level. And uh, Rick, if you want to uh, fill out that player creation application real quick and comment it, we can get you created as our 10th fighter. Or... We can go ahead and get a fight going right now to give... Oh, there he is. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, we can go ahead and get a fight going, and then he can go ahead and do it. But we're just going to get him created right out of the bat. 
So, okay, so 6'6 six, six is the tallest you can be, but I got you. 247 striker, two sleeve, and full back tat. I got you. All right, so striker. If you don't want tats, it's okay. I'll be, it'll be faster. Um, yeah, we'll avoid tats just for now. At the end, we can definitely do tats, though. I want to be like Connor. Okay, I got you. All right, so Ricky. Trying to go as quickly as possible. Can I do zeros? Oh, okay, we can't do zero, zero, zero. One or more of the words you entered is invalid. Fine, we'll just do double zeros, game. Joke's on you. Nope, don't do that. I just make everybody 18 for the heck of it, and you wanted 247. There we go. All right, so if you find me a no win, ooh. Yeah, I'm assuming that's fight no win. Got you. But, uh. All right, so appearance, you said... Oh, you didn't say. Okay. So, what kind of skin tone? So, my birthday was the other day, and I passed... Whoa, what is that? How about uh, we go ahead and get rid of that crap, and we remove it. Thanks for that random stuff. We're going to uh, remove that, and we're also going to put you in a timeout for doing it twice, bro. But, uh... <laughs> All right, so you said white. See ya. Oh, wait. See my winning pose. Be oh, gotcha. Okay, I got you. All right, so white. I'm going to give you this one. And all right. Let me scroll up. That guy with his random whatever links he was posting covered up a lot of the page here. I was trying to read this right here. So my birthday was the other day, and I passed my driver's test in the snow. I never even practiced, and I just did six hours and boom license. Very nice. Okay. Brown eyes. Okay, got you. Uh, we'll go lighter brown like that so you can actually see him a little bit. So what kind of hairstyle? Um, short, long, uh, fro, buzz on the sides, uh, super long, dreads, whenever comb over, the uh, the fro hawk stuff. Buzz on the sides? Okay, so what kind of buzz? Buds or are... You want this one? Actually, that one's not all that cool. Uh, maybe this one. Let's see. Buzz. Cool buzz on the side. We'll give you. Okay. That's like a Johnny Bravo haircut there. This is the one I have. We'll give you this one. You want this one? It's somewhat like a mohawk. And can my guy be a little bit more tan? Yeah, I got you. Uh, okay, that's kind of a yellow. Do you want to be like that? Or gonna be like that. We'll give you that one right now because the other one's kind of more yellow. That Mr. Shawn. Oh, this is Ricky. But yeah, so what kind of body style do you want as I get rid of your body hair here? And do you want any facial hair, by the way? Eyebrows. I'm just randomly changing everybody's eyebrows to different things. Uh, facial hair. So we'll do facial hair and then we'll do your body style. I'm just gonna randomly click ones just because I want to see them. You just let me know which ones you want. I want body style and what types. Um, you know, like athletic, ripped, more buff, flabby, um, etc. A mixture of, you know, ripped and buff. Give you a goatee. <laughs> Huge beard. I got you. Uh, we'll give you this one because I did just create another fighter with the other one. Unless you wanted. That one somewhat got like a French stash to it. That one's more comb, but you did say huge, so we'll give you this one. And now body style. Full athletic, and I just ate best cookies I have ever had. Well, unfortunately, you can't share them. And the oh my god doesn't help. <laughs> Alright, so you said athletic. Let's give you this one because this is the like most athletic one i think you could have and it's also the body that i have so tattoos we're gonna skip for now uh mouth guard i'll quickly go through these let me know which one you want uh you know cage green black with yellow red and white whenever camo of brown or white ice vampire red vamp grill teeth ufc countries etc <laughs> sean mafia with the cookies you want green? Got you. Alright, accessories. Alright, so now we got skills. So what kind of fire do you want to be? Obviously, I think you said this already, but it's long gone by the chat 
just lighten up. <laughs> but uh, as I take these down, let me know what you want. You like striking speed, striking power, accuracy, blocking, movement speed, um, clinch if anybody wants. And I'm sure everybody's just gonna go straight, stand and bang for the first few episodes of the YTB series. We just wanna lay everybody out once we get further into you know high levels you know more end game type of fighters will be more well balanced and will you know nobody ever wants to take anybody to the ground but just the fact that we want to stop people from taking us to the ground um we'll eventually get to uh, those attributes but of course everybody just wants to knock each other out for the first couple episodes do you like fortnite at all um i don't know like i did at the beginning i was never a big fan of the building i'm more you know i like shooting games but the whole building thing I never really got that fast at and now I don't have the game downloaded at all and with all the crazy additions they've made I have not done and since you want speed Ricky I'm gonna give you straight 100 speed I'm gonna make you the fastest fighter out of everybody so let me go to 200 minus 70 for that so you got 130 don't forget to change me oh I got you Preston you said you wanted was it Conor McGregor what is with these people right here? You guys need to go ahead and get out of here. We're going to go ahead and put you guys, this guy, in timeout. We're going to remove those. Moderators, if you will, please get on top of people like that. I was going to say, uh, no ground game, more speed with punches and dodges. Gotcha. So we're going to give you 70 power, minus 40. But yeah, the, all the moderators, obviously everybody that is in my YTV series, you guys are moderators. So I will give everybody the power to do so. Um, you guys have the power to time out, remove comments, all those good things. So we have 90 left. You said it, you wanted dodge. Nobody has dodge yet. So we'll give you 50, which still isn't a whole lot. It's only 20 improvement, but makes you faster with head movement than anybody. Uh, we got you just... Got to do the start. Oh, yeah, no problem. All right, so you have 70 points left. What do you want the rest into? We can do accuracy, blocking, of course. Uh, there's fitness. There's health, which, of course, is going to be your toughness about not getting knocked out. But I will give you a moment to uh, let me know. Because you have 70 points left. 30 accuracy got you put you up to 70 you're actually the uh, most accurate fighter out of everybody then so that's you said 30 accuracy that's 60 my bad <laughs> all right so minus 30 you got 40 left 10 health so we'll just do 10 into head and chest which is gonna give you 20 points left and 20 blocking oops don't do that and 20 blocking okay which is gonna make you Perfect right there. So you got 55 striking, a little bit of health, uh, moves I gotta go ahead and take off. And if you have a favorite fighter for your personality and your stance, you can go ahead and let me know. Um, and then we'll go ahead and get into these fights since uh, it's almost been an hour of adding extra people into the series, which of course I'm happy about. Um, procrastinates the uh, fight schedule a little bit, but of course it's gonna make the series even that much better. And I do got to reiterate or remind you guys that uh, you can go ahead and make sure it's PG, not PG-13, just PG. And uh, don't get you know too heated on each other. But go ahead and start some beef in the chat because you are allowed to challenge the other fighters in this series. So feel free to call out other people. Feel free to call me out. Of course, I am down to fight all of you as I hit circle here. I do have to fight Dondre Welch first because he was the first person to call me out. He said he wanted to fight me, so we gotta make sure that happens. Not saying I will be the first fight of the day today, but uh, we, him and me will be fighting today. And uh, Preston said, McGregor, I got you. Oh, McGregor sucks like your fighter. Ooh, that's that beef I'm talking about, but yeah. <laughs> Oop, what am I doing? Scrolling down. Everybody always has this rear naked choke. And then, there we go. We are finally... No, I forgot about the uh, stances here. Personality. Conor McGregor. Starts with a C. I was about to scroll all the way up. Okay, so where am I going? I gotta go down more. Conor McGregor. Uh, Walk-up music doesn't matter. Posture. Who wants to fight, Preston? <laughs> 
All right, so Conor McGregor here. Stan. Oh, did I just do? No, Stan said that. Okay, so save, save. Okay. All right, so uh, Preston, where did you say you wanted your uh, personality and things changed to? Did you want Conor McGregor as well, or do you want another fighter? Other than that, we are calling out everybody. I have a bunch of messages throughout my platforms. There we go. Alright, so Preston does want Conor McGregor. Alright, so let's go ahead and go to my fighters. Look at the 10 fighters that we have in God Bear, Sonic Beast, Mr. Hit Hard, Dragon Elite, Andre Walsh, Sean Mafia, Punch Play, CJ Hype, uh, The Mafia, which is Ryan Mafia, and Ricky00. But first, we got this man right here. We're going to change to Conor McGregor. Alright, so yeah, let me really quickly swap this page over. So I know we got me versus Dondre. We got Ricky versus Hyphy. We got. Alright, first person I want to fight is the one of the brothers. Okay, I got you. Well, you guys want to go at each other's throats. Alright, let me go up to Connor. Posture. Also Connor. Actually, Preston, you wanna Preston, you wanna fight me? I'll fight you. Alright, so there we go. Alright, so we have two matchups right now, which is gonna be me versus Dondre. We got Ricky versus Hyphy. We'll go Godbear versus Hold on. Me versus somebody again, but the first person he wants to fight is one of the brothers. So we got Dondre. Hold on, let me do this again. We'll go one at a time. Um, how does betting work? All right, so betting, whoever we figure out is fighting first. So for example, actually, let's figure out who's going to fight first. So who wants to fight first? And who do you want to fight? So we're going to start off by making a rivalry here. So... What am I looking for? I'm looking for... It's just over here. The fight modes. Fight now. Okay, there we go. So can I get... Oh yeah, Asante Beast. You can fight me. I will fight first. Can I get the tats? Uh, yeah, hold on. We'll do his tats first. And we'll start off with Hyphy and Ricky. So starting this off... We're going to go Hyphy... Versus Ricky. And that's your guys' first fight of the day. Everybody's doing two fights today. Do a tournament, but make in two weeks. Oh, I got you. Actually, Ricky, just to save time, since we're already just right here ready for these fights, we'll do your tattoos at the end of the stream if you're still here for it. Because we definitely want to get a fight going. Uh, so we get prepared for two weeks and we go, okay, I got you. But uh, we need to go to heavyweight. And we, of course, I just went to straw weight. Let's find CJ Hyphy here. It's alphabetically. Here he is. All right, so CJ Hyphy. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah, versus Ricky Zero Zeros. Okay, so, of course, I'm in the center here. And now what I'm about to do here is we're going to start... All right, so the most current points is by Dondre Walsh and Sean Mafia. So we're going to start a bet here, and we're going to say Hyphy versus Ricky. And first option, of course, if I can spell correctly, is Hyphy. Add that. Second option, if I can really spell here, is, oh my lord, I cannot type. Ricky, the payout is going to be doubling uh you know what we're gonna double coins we're gonna double coins people can bet from 1 to 50 here we're gonna start this so you guys type exclamation mark bet zero for hyphy exclamation mark bet one for ricky so hyphy is zero and ricky is one so you can bet anywhere between 0 or 1 and 50 of your points. 
So, oh yeah, Ricky, you have to go explanation, bet one, and then how many points you want to bet. My bad. So yeah, explanation mark, explanation mark, bet zero or one, and then how many points. There we go. So yeah, we got one bet for Ricky, which was Asante Beast. I'll give you guys a little bit more time because, of course, I'm the one. We got one bet for Hypey, one bet for Ricky. Oh, uh, my bad. Uh, Ricky, you don't have... Let me see how many coins you have. Ricky, your bet didn't go through because you have 20 points right now. My bad. Uh, so I'll go through Asante Beast. Yours didn't go through because you have 15 points at the moment. Dondre Welch, yeah, you have... 42 points now because you used 23. How do I check your points? Oh, yeah, do exclamation mark points to check how many points you have. I guess that would make sense. I should have said that first for you guys. <laughs> but yeah, type in explanation points to see how many points you do have. And then explanation mark bet the number and how many points you want to bet on this fight. But yeah, I'm, I'm new to the betting thing with you guys so of course it's gonna make this so much fun even with the YTV Madden series you guys can also bet on that um, bet on which team is gonna win and uh, did it go through uh, let's see here uh, hyphy bet Asante Beast bet Sean Mafia bet I don't see a bet from Ricky quite yet who do you think is gonna win oh I guess I could bet you know what Hold on, let's look at stats. Over here. Alright, so... I don't know how, but Ricky has a 7-point boost in his striking over CJ Hyphy. Of course, they both have 200 points put into their player. Oh, wait, so, uh, hold on, let me see. How many coins do you have? Oh, Ricky, you have 0 coins, so you bet all your coins. Uh, Preston, we will do your fight next after this one. But, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead. Uh, we have five bets currently. We have two for Hyphy and three for Ricky. So you guys think Ricky's going to win. I think Ricky's going to win. Uh, wait. Okay, you need to bet one. Okay, I'm going to say Ricky's going to win. And it's purely because he's got plus seven in his striking. So we will see if that's actually going to make a difference. Because, of course, both fighters have the same amount of tribute points put into their fighter. It just thinks that you have better allocated tribute points. So we're going to go ahead and stop the betting right there. And we're going to go ahead and get this fight going. Yes, no dual shock. No one is controlling uh, blue shorts and black shorts. Sure, we'll do it. Uh, we'll do three rounds because it's not a championship thing. Real time. Here we go. What? Oh, I gotta go up here. Here we go. <laughs> Good luck to both the fighters. Oh, I missed this too. I'm so hyped. Oh, man. You guys. Good luck. Of course, we do gotta find out who is going to be fighting next. So if we want to go ahead and get that going. I know Preston wants the next one. So who here wants to fight Preston? Who wants to build a rivalry? And, okay, you can either go down by Preston or show Preston up by wanting the next fight. So, who wants to go next up against Preston? He is Mr. Hit Hard, and Dondre wants him. He was the first one to call it. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to do Dondre versus Mr. Hit Hard. Alright, so that is the next matchup after these guys. Lightning fast hand speed. Striker has fans buzzing about their debut. And of course, you're going to either win and decide to get tats because you win. Or you're going to lose and you're going to go get tats to toughen up your fighter. So one of those two reasons, you're going to get tats. <laughs> and we're going to find out what it says about high feet. <laughs> Conor McGregor. Look at my flamboyant arm movements. And now, of course, we got Hyphy coming. I'm kind of curious what it's going to say about him. I'm sure a lot of us is going to say the same thing because our attribute points are into very few of the attributes right now. But 
Yeah, we're all gonna be from Las Vegas. Because we're all from the YTB series. Uh, can you skip his intro? <laughs> skip his intro? Yeah. Here he is. What's it gonna say about him? Ah, it says has recently burst onto the UFC scene. Well balanced and says they'll take the UFC by storm. So of course he said he wanted to be the most balanced and of course that is what he is. So we'll see if balance prevails here or if being good at one aspect, you know, more so of one aspect than being balanced of course, is gonna pay out for either fighter. Let's go. I'm going to skip after the entrances. I just want to see what it says about each fighter. And after this point right here, we're not going to watch the whole, this fighter hasn't fought at all. This fighter hasn't fought at all. <laughs> we're going to get past that. Reach advantage, of course, goes to our man Ricky as well. I'm sorry, Hyphy. I'm going to ruin your career. So yeah, right here, we're going to go ahead and skip this point if I can, please. It's not going to let me. Let me skip. Hyphy <laughs> says he doesn't have one. Alright, so unfortunately we'll have to watch the entire scenes for everybody because this part I don't think makes that much of a difference because you see the height and weight of the fighters beforehand. And of course, we're created fighters, so in terms of this, it will not keep track of our record, but with the YTB series, I do I already got a layout for everybody's record and this is the debut fight of this YTB UFC series and I'm excited to see how it's gonna pan out of course we got plenty more fights after this one but this is gonna kick it off oh good luck to you guys trying to throw some knees you guys are trying to Test each other's range. Feel it out. Somebody hit somebody. <laughs> and I did choose the uh, the tight camera angle. I want it to be super close on our fighters. I don't want the wide view of the standard game. I want to have you know the best close up look of our fighters. And uh, the HUD is also gone, so we won't know how hurt people are until it's too late. Of course, you'll see them stagger. Ooh, that's a nice little... Caught the kick and then jabbed into the face. <gasps> Ooh, not cool, Haifi. <laughs> but yeah, Haifi, it's your fighter. If it's born, you gotta... I guess be less balanced. No, you're throwing some kicks now. You, got, you took a shot to the face. You're continuously throwing kicks. I don't know what Ricky's doing, but he's got this whole push strategy going. I'm watching Floyd May <laughs> Mayweather, a counterfighter. You guys are wanting to push a bunch. Oh, caught another one, took another shot. Okay. Ricky's got more power than you, Hyphy, so you're going to have to watch about... Throwing them kicks because that's the second one he's caught and made you pay for it. I will know we'll change from real time to accelerated clock after this one. Ooh, okay. There's like a kick that turned into a knee to the face. Knock him out. <laughs> Ooh, okay, Hyphy. You gotta stop throwing them kicks. That's the third one now that you've paid for. You guys are throwing a lot of feints as well. <laughs> if he can't control it. Alright, we'll, we'll chalk it up to the nerves of your guys' fighters. You guys, you know, it's a brand new series. You guys, oh, I'm surprised it didn't make you pay for that one. But you guys, you know, the nerves getting to you. You're the first showcase of the series. You don't want to start off too strong or, you know, get knocked out because, you know, you're trying to warm up. How does your face feel, Hyphy, says Ricky. <laughs> 
Hypey's just trying to tear apart the midsection of Ricky right now with all of these kicks. Ooh, okay, nice knee. Hypey's got that weird like kick that turns into a knee that he's connected with twice now. You guys can see it. Look at the midsection of Ricky when he turns a little bit. It is definitely getting red as Hyphy once again gets caught with one of those kicks. Oh, oh, okay. I will say you're. I forgot what Ricky's power was, but I will say you're probably lucky you didn't match up with someone even more powerful that uh can even more make you regret throwing them leg kicks but again maybe it's ricky's fighter that is aware enough to catch those kicks and once he improves that power the mixture of him catching them kicks and then just taking your momentum straight back from connecting with your face is going to be a lethal combination Could it be that it's like this because you took away everyone's moves? Um, I don't think it's that. It's just they're almost like waiting for somebody to make a move before they throw out a, a strike. Because the moves is all about how quickly they walk or move between one another. Alright, first round is going to be over. A little bit lackluster. Hopefully they pick it up in the second round. And again, we'll definitely have to go an accelerated clock just to make that go a little bit quicker. It's going to show the highlights. Definitely a lot of belly kicks. And then a lot of quick jabs after catching some of those kicks. Was like my big dog wants inside. Come on, big guy. There we go. <laughs> the tanker boy wanted inside, so we had to let him in. I'm gonna win by decision <laughs> with belly kicks. <laughs> hey, you never know. Oh yeah, doggo. Look, he's a good guy. He's up on the bed behind me. Mm, good dog. <laughs> Very spoiled. He's a good boy. Alright, but back to the fight. Hopefully you guys pick it up. Start throwing some more strikes. Of course, that may leave you, know, leave you open to get countered. But if you can connect with him. Hyphy, how many punches that you, have you actually thrown? You've pushed him, but you've thrown a lot of kicks. Oh, where's the face cam? I can't add it. If you guys really want it, I can throw it up real quick. But it will take up some of the screen here. Because I got such a tight window with the screen I'm gonna cover up whoever's on the right side unless I put myself way in the top right corner all right hold on let me I'll throw it up I gotta plug in my webcam I'm gonna connect this thing let me do video capture device the webcam not that one it is that one. Configure. Configure. Advanced settings. Not advanced settings. Not follow my face. Save. I'm looking for that. There we go. We're here. Hey guys, I'm uh, covering up every, every somebody's face. Let me, uh, nope, wrong thing. I'm trying to select the corner here. Thank you. Let me put myself up here. There we go. Hey, I got a shirt that I didn't think I would be uh, on a stream, but we're here. Oh, your fam's dog got in a fight this morning with a fox? Well, my dudes, right here. Right here. Right here. Good boy. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, let me throw up the, uh, my, my border real quick. Because I like my border. Alright, let me select picture, cup bear, border. There we go. 
and it's in the center let me select the picture there we go make it smaller put myself in the corner we'll make it like this size like right there that should be good but then I got to select the webcam why is that webcam weird size properties why is it such weird size that's weird size I don't even know why it's like that anyways I'm gonna remove it for now I gotta mess what kind of dog go he's a he's a rescue dog but uh he's like Pitbull and like Jimmy Shorthair Pointer or something like that. I'm not completely sure what he is. Because uh, he is a rescue dog, so I don't know, you know, what's really in him. But he's he's moving. Take her. Come here. You already messed up the bed. Come here. Arr. Arr. Give me your foot. Give me your foot. Come here. Come here. You guys, I don't know. I want to show you off real quick while this fight is being lackluster. Come here. Come here. Come here. I don't know how well you guys can see him. Oh, I'm watching the Super Bowl for sure. Going over to a uh, family's house and I'm watching it. <laughs> You're a goofball. You're just a goofball. Okay. You got your TV time. You're okay. All right. But yeah, that's the boy. I'll have to uh, better set up the webcam um, when uh, obviously I go offline to better, you know, the. Uh, angle or something's messed up and I feel like wearing a hat so I'm gonna wear a hat I'm wearing clothes I wasn't expecting to wear clothes for I'm gonna take the hat off I changed my mind already but uh wait you still have the blanket on oh yeah he's good about keeping that on but uh wait what do you eat and what do you think oh I think I want the Rams to win I do not want Brady to win another Super Bowl All right, so another round is over. I wasn't watching a whole lot of that, <laughs> that round, to be honest. But it did look like Ricky's face was a little beat up. Oh, on the chair. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's because dog hair collects on this office chair. I'm waiting to get an actual gaming chair. Um, hopefully, before Anthem comes out. They have yet to actually email me um, when my order is actually being mailed out but I'll show you the uh, the per can I show you the purchase order I'll show you part of the purchase order of the chair load images view my order I just want to look at my chair it's not gonna show my chair so I'll just type it in real quick and show you guys from uh, my phone oh yeah Preston you've seen it that's because we know each other in real life. But, uh. I'll type it in and I will find it here. Let's see. This one right here. Alright, so. This is the chair I'm getting. And of course, it's gonna be way cooler, way more comfortable. Than the thing I'm sitting in. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. Yeah. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, Preston is my uncle. Or Preston is my uncle. No, Preston is my nephew, and uh, his fighter is Mr. Hit Hard. Dog goes being cute back there. You guys need to pick it up. And I, how much? Was that share? It was sixty dollars. They're typically two hundred dollars, but they had an eighty percent sale, and uh, a New Year sale, and of course, hard to pass up. And having a YouTube channel, that chair is going to look awesome. And of course, I game a lot, so why not have a gaming chair? Make it more comfortable, much more visually appealing, and 
who do you guys think is winning this fight right now? Because I did miss round two. And Hyphy's... I don't know how many more times he's been punched in the face for throwing kicks. Is that sale still on? I'm not sure. I haven't checked. Because I know the sale did end on the 23rd of January. But then my cousin said that they extended the sale or something like that. But I don't know for how much longer. Uh, Dondre thinks that Ricky's winning the fight. Hyphy, this is your fighter. Let me know if you think that you or Ricky is winning this fight. You guys, this is a push fest. You guys are some pansies. Uh, what was the website? Here, let me find it. I'll search it up on my laptop real quick. And I will uh, let you know. I got to scroll a little bit to find it. But I will find it. Mm, no. Apparently, I've shared a lot of links. <laughs> Just gotta scroll up and find it. Keep scrolling, keep scrolling. Uh, was it this long ago? I don't think it's this long ago. Talking to myself, just looking through. Uh, okay, I went too far. One sec, I'm trying to find it. Uh, let's see. Here, let me, I'll just type in real quick. Currently don't see any of your guys' messages, but, uh. Yeah, I currently don't see anything about it, so I'm not sure. But uh, Ricky says he's going to lose. I have more strikes landed. Okay. Can he spice up the moveset after this? Uh, we'll see how game two goes. I will turn on accelerated clock after this. Because right now it's real time. And that makes the fight seem like... Okay, makes the fight literally longer. But it's about to be decision time. We're going to find out who wins. I know Ricky's body on this left side that we see looks super beat up. Oh, and that's probably why <laughs> catching those knees. Oh, Ricky hit him. Hit him, Ricky. He's wobbled. <laughs> All right, that's the fight right there. Let's find out how the judges are going to score it. A lot of those. He's about to throw like a spinning back fist or something like that. Round two, it's going to show another time he gets connected from one of those kicks. And for round three, it's going to show another one. Okay. CJ's definitely got his hand raised. Let's see what Ricky's reactions are. Okay, Ricky's got his hand raised too, so apparently this is going to be close. Who's going to win it? Oh, okay. Hyphy won. There we go. So I have to right click and pick winner for Hyphy. We'll see who won those two votes, which was Hyphy, of course, and then Dondre Welch. You guys are rewarded with 60 and 66 more points. All right, so let me circle this because I was writing down who won. Which hyphy won. And then next fight we'll definitely make sure accelerated clock is on. Or accelerated time. So, alright. So, what? 
hold on. That doesn't make sense. Look at the significant strikes. 13 out of 13 for Ricky. But then 4 out of 7. But it says total strikes 0 out of 185. How is that possible? How is that 0 out of 5? That, that's weird. That's weird. Anyways, Hyphy wins the first one. We're going to go ahead and jump to... Dondre versus our man Preston here. Oop, we were already on heavyweight. So Dondre Welch's W's go up. There he is. And now we got Mr. Hit Hard. Starts with an H. There he is. Let me go ahead and change. You know what? Just for the sake of it, I'm going to go ahead and turn off the webcam for now. I'll uh, get it all set up for the next stream for you guys. Uh, just right now, it's a little weird. I was not prepared for it. But, uh... I'll let you guys look at their attributes. Of course, you see Hit Hard has more health, so it's going to be harder to knock out. Let me reset this real quick. Let me go Welch versus Hit Hard. First option is Welch. Oh. Remove. Remove. There we go. Now Hit Hard. There we go. We're going to go ahead and start it. So remember, make sure you do exclamation points to check who your, you know, your amount of coins. And then, of course, zero for Welch and one for Hit Hard. So explanation part, bet. And then the number you want to bet for being zero or one. And then the amount of coins you do want to bet. And apparently Asante Beast is betting in ponies. <laughs> no, just a typo, but it looks makes it look like ponies with a Y. But uh, <laughs> just a funny little typo. And uh, we quickly got two bets for Welch here. We'll see if anybody wants to bet for Preston, a.k.a. Mr. Hit Hard. Preston, you can bet for yourself if you want to. You can do exclamation mark points, and it'll let you know how many points you have or I can just let you know, which is 80 coins right now, or 80 points. So uh, Preston, if you wanted to bet for yourself, you could do exclamation point, bet, space one, space 80, and you can bet on yourself. Yeah, Preston, there's your point. See, it says you got 80 points. And so you can do exclamation mark, bet, space 1 space 80 and bet everything you have on your own fighter and if you win the fight you'll go from 80 points to 160 points so wait so after this fight it's as slow as the last you can move oh yeah if it's as slow as it was last time i'll allow everybody to add a move to their fighter if it's at you know, if it's that same slow pace. I am going to put accelerated time on instead of real time. So the fights are going to go that much quicker. But uh, we'll give Preston a moment to uh, exclamation point bet space one space 80 or any amount that he wants. Oh, max bait is 50. Okay, my bad, Hyphy. Yeah, I completely just bypassed what you even said there. Oh, yeah, but uh, yeah, Preston. So do exclamation point bet space one space 50 so you can do here like this here i'm gonna i'm gonna put a random letter at the beginning so don't put the trust part <laughs> i'm just gonna put trust in there so it doesn't make me bet but do space and then like that so type it how i have at the end so do the explanation point bet space one space 50 and you'll bet 50 points on yourself Because right now we have all four votes for... Okay, now there's one for Hit Hard because it's Preston. But yeah, we got four votes for Welch, one vote for Hit Hard. And we're going to go ahead and stop the bets. I'm going to go in the middle. And we're going to go ahead and get this fight going. Blue shorts, black shorts. We're going to go... Yeah, accelerated. And here we go. Next time we're going to make sure we change the arena just to swap it up. Oh, did Hyphy miss it? <laughs> gotcha. But, uh, 
I wanted to win something back. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, but here we go. I'm curious about this one. This is going to be interesting. Uh, I actually didn't bet, but I could have bet. I'm going to go ahead and say you, Preston. Just because we're family, we got to stick together. Oh, hi, if you bet on Welsh. Got you. Yeah, there's only one person that betted for Preston, and it was himself. But I'm there as a confidence vote. It's not an actual point vote, but I'm there for a motivational vote. And it's for my nephew. So let's go. And he says, has recently burst on the scene. He's a brawler, and fans are buzzing about their debut. Of course, every category is probably going to say one actual thing about them. Just because, you know, everybody's attribute points are very low. <laughs> We're not a very high overall. But he is very tatted up, straight out of prison, out here to fight Dondre Welch. And of course, seeing that little wavy arm, I guess, animation is very funny from a tatted up fighter. I'm there for a confident <laughs> vote for you too, Preston, says Hyphy. <laughs> but coin vote for Welch. See, I might change, uh, right now it's points, but I'm thinking about changing it to coins. What do you guys want? Do you want it to be points or coins? <laughs> the McBrigger swag. Uh, so it says good punching power, brawler, and says they'll take the UFC by storm. So both of them are going to have good punch power. Obviously, Mr. Hit Hard hits hard with 100 power. I think Welch has 90 or 100. I'm not sure if it was 100 or not. But uh, yeah, same thing. It's it's just a matter of what you guys type in. So you don't want to do like explanation points or explanation point um, or coins. My bad. All right, so there is a reach advantage to Welch. We'll see how much of an advantage that is going to be. Do what you like. Okay. Maybe we'll just do a... No. <laughs> Change it. So just you guys have to put in an exclamation point. I don't know, something ridiculous like explanation. It's all pudding cups. You guys are voting pudding cups. That's what I'm going to change it to. It's more for you to type in, and it's just an odd thing to bet with. Oh, <laughs> everybody wants you to win, Preston, but they feel like Welch is going to win. We'll put it that way. That's where all the, the betting went, but we got the most... Hope for you. <laughs> Alright, but here we go. Oh, looks like Dondre wanted to touch gloves a little bit. And now, back to the pushing fest. I don't, I've never seen pushing like that. What is that? Are those supposed to be, like, actual strikes? I feel like those are actually supposed to be punches. But since I took them away, it's not going to be punches. Which might be a problem. And if that is the case, I'll give everybody, like, limited strikes. And then you can change those strikes to certain, you know, another point. Or add strikes. Or level up those strikes. Amongst... Just putting more tribute points into your fighter. But I'm starting to think if they continue to push each other. Uh, I'm going to give this 30 more seconds. And if they don't throw a punch, we're just going to go ahead and go to everybody. Give them basic strikes. And we're going to rematch Hyphy versus uh, Ricky. Because that's not fair for them to... I have a push fest. Okay. Alright, so yeah, we're, we're going to restart this. We're going to go give everybody the most basic strikes. 
Because that... One, the fights are just going to be lackluster. Those are supposed to be punches? Yeah, those are not punches. Those are little... Yeah. Push fests. Alright, so we'll start with me. And we'll give everybody, like, two punches and two kicks. So style, it's supposed to be skill, moves. So first one, jab. Second one... No, that's level two. Whoops, my bad. Jab, level one. Second one, a straight. So we'll give everybody a jab and a straight. Wait, what's the second one? That's a hook. No, we need like a kick. Is there any kicks? What is this? Is this a kick? No, it's an uppercut. Oh, uh, everybody needs a kick. It's square? No? <laughs> what button? Oh, kicks. Dumb. I'm dumb. So level one, level one. There we go. We'll just do that. We'll give everybody a jab and a straight and leg kicks. That's all we're going to do from the get-go. Should make things way better. Wait, you're on punches? Press R1? Gotcha. Yeah, <laughs> my bad. All right, so that's what we're going to do. That's all we need. Just give everybody straights and some kicks. So we'll do that real quick. We'll refight Hyphy versus Ricky. Oh, let me... I'm going to cancel this bet. Oh, how do I do this? I have to... I'm just going to reset it. Yeah, I'm just going to reset. I'm going to remove all of them. Oh, wait. You guys lose your things, huh? Did that actually reimburse you guys? Okay, it gave your points back I believe okay we're okay we're good hooks instead of straights uh, I'll leave hooks for you guys to change into just basic strikes for now have builds be the things Oop, jab no I keep doing there straight level one Level one. Just gonna go through these real quick. Ah, so yeah, it's only gonna take an hour and a half to actually get this thing going correctly, but I uh, appreciate you guys sticking through the struggles. Of course, trying to get things re going and uh, had to get a few players created and then uh, better get. <laughs> <laughs> get the uh, actual fight correctly working with the minimum that we should be because the YTB series people gotta be lackluster at the beginning until we start being good Ooh, straight level one level one level one I guess if Ricky isn't here, he's going to have a pleasant surprise if he comes back and he's like, I thought I lost, but he whooped Hyphy's butt. Alright, loading symbol. He probably will, yeah. Alright. Try to go through this as quickly as I can. Not stats, moves. Dang it, went too fast. There we go. Alright. I feel like this loading symbol is a thing taking the most time. If we want, we can uh, go ahead and figure out who the next fights are going to be. You know what? Fine. We got Hyphy versus Ricky right now, then Dondre versus Hit Hard. It's going to be me versus who wants to fight me as the third fight of the night. 
After all these fights, can you send me a pic of my stats? Oh yeah, I got you, Hyphy. Yeah, who wants to fight me for the third fight? God dang it, I keep hitting circle on that part. Your bro? Alright. So that's the Mafia. Alright, so it's going to be me versus Mafia. Or a Mafia. The Mafia. There's only four people watching, I think. A lot got up. Oh, gotcha, yeah. Definitely took us a while to, <laughs> to get things going. Um, for people that don't, you know, choose their fights, they'll just randomly get selected a fight. And since this has taken so long, we might just do one fight for each person. But then having next episode, which will be Saturday at 6 p.m. Pacific Time, 9 Eastern, um, we'll, you know, have things correctly working from the get-go. No character creations because I'll have them all, you know, set up ahead of time if we have new members because people will comment you know in the video versus uh joining oh <gasps> you cheater this man would have had leg kicks level two did you guys see that apparently i missed a point let's uh double check you aren't hiding anything else in here clinch you can't take that off everybody has that no submissions or anything okay so it's just that leg kick that i missed all right Somebody would have went in there with a, a little bit of a head kicking. <laughs> we would have been like, man, his fart is really good. But no, he would have had head kick level two. We just thought that Sean Moffey would have been a goon, had the right build. Just like that background right there. That's what we've been doing. Face kicks. Uh, punch plays I will go ahead and go back to hyphy versus Ricky let me remove these two votes go to skill I keep going here skills all right let me go hyphy let me go Ricky and let me go ahead and start the vote for you guys so you guys can vote while I'm doing this Who just came back? Uh, not sure. I've been not paying a whole lot of attention to the, the view count. Just trying to wrap this whole setting everything up. <laughs> and uh, editing players. Ooh, 39 for Ricky. Dondre's going. Ooh, Hyphy gets a vote for himself. <laughs> So lead leg kick, is that an actual head kick? It's a body kick and a leg kick, okay. So if you guys want actual head kicks, you'll have to uh, choose one from leveling up. But that's gonna be a huge part of this. Like of course, when you do win a fight or lose two fights, just whenever you grow a level, you get five attribute points to put into your fighter. You can either also choose a perk or a move. So that's gonna be huge. Being able to choose specific strikes for your fighter, building him a certain way, having him have a certain combo is going to be ridiculous. So yeah, leveling. Oh, I'll show you guys real quick. This is how leveling works. You win a fight, you level up. You also get to choose a perk or a move. And then if you lose a fight, it's half a level, so you're going to have to either lose again or win a fight. But of course, that half level will remain there. So if you eventually lose another fight, you will still grow a level. Other than that... Um, this was uh, our original fighters. You see we had Godbear, Hithard, Welch, Beast, Elite, and Sean Mafia. But we gained four new members. And that's going to keep track of everybody's record. And uh, we're right here right now though. Trying to, uh, of course, get through these real quick. No, I just... See, so, yeah, UFC in terms of leveling very simple 
but how you build your player is going to be very complex, especially with the move sets and the perks. Perks are going to be huge too. Because not only are there perks and moves, but you can level up those perks and moves. So you can either choose to gain a bunch of moves or make a certain move very powerful because you can get it up to level 5. And it changes the percentage of how hard that strike hits. And we're on our last fighter and we're going to go ahead and get the fighter, or the fight back going. So I'm happy this didn't take a whole lot of time. But now people are actually going to hit one another because... I didn't think it was going to be that terrible. <laughs> what is with these guys here? Time out. It's the third one now. These guys coming in here just trying to promote crap. Yeah, everybody's a mod. All right, so there. We got all 10 fighters updated. Here we go again. Bet coins on you. I got you, Preston. Right now, we do have to uh, rematch Hyphy versus Ricky real quick because I don't feel right, you know, having them, you know, to deal with how that went. I want them to be able to, you know, equally have a chance like everybody else. And what was the other one? I gotta go up. Two double zeros. What? Why did that go from V's to zero? Or to... Oh, it's circle. It's... Yeah, it's... Oh, not... There we go. That makes more sense. All right, so yeah. I believe everybody got their bets in. I'll let you guys look at everybody again. Of course, you see that Ricky has the better striking. And now that they actually have striking moves, maybe that'll make more of a difference than the push fest that they had last time that hyphy actually won so i am going to remove a win from you hyphy i apologize but uh i am just about to close the betting we have one vote for hyphy which was by himself and then three votes for ricky i'm gonna give you guys about 10 more seconds to put any last minute votes in and then of course we're gonna go ahead and get it going so in three two one we're gonna stop it and we're Am I in the middle? Ah, oh, I just circled out too far. Gosh darn it. Okay. Alright, back to high feet. I couldn't see where my mouse was. <laughs> back to double O. There we go. And now I'm in the center. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Circle, circle, or X, X, X. Going. Alright, good luck to you guys. This is going to be a real fight now. You guys are actually going to be able to throw strikes. Hit each other in the faces. Obviously, it's not like any devastating strikes. That is for when anybody grows a level, you can instantly, like I said, give yourself an overhand strike. And then everyone's going to have to worry about that one move that you added. Oh yeah, finally a real fight. It only took an hour and 48 minutes, just about, <laughs> to get a real fight going. But again, appreciate you guys sticking through this. Obviously, it had a little bit more struggles than I would have liked, but uh, I feel like we definitely finally got things going, have standard strikes for everybody, and then again, when you do win a fight or lose two fights, whenever you do grow a level, the moves you get to add and leveling those moves up is going to be a huge aspect in this UFC game. Oh yeah, if you haven't yet liked the video, much appreciated. <laughs> Dondre. I know a lot of you guys are building up them coins already couple of you, a few of you, already got over 100 coins. Or 100 points. That's going to be annoying. I'm going to keep saying... <laughs> I mean, I'll like it if I win. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, I say a few of you are had over 100 points. But that's if or you lose 
or win a bet. I think I can go ahead and put this at max volume. Is that better for you guys? Do you, can you hear more of the crowd? I had at negative 15%, but uh, I put it just back to standard. Can you hear any of uh, the backgrounds of the game better now? Because I believe you guys should be able to hear, you know, it's the crowd, it's the effects, so when you, someone gets hit in the face, you'll be able to hear it more. The surprisingly negative 15% dropped it down a drastic amount. Let's go, ref. All right, here we go. The real debut and showcase of the YTV UFC series. There are some actual punches. Oh, <laughs> this is instantly much better. Instantly, way better. Yeah, the strike set was the key. Having no moves, they literally was just pushing each other, and not even really pushing each other. But now they're actually making contact. Oh, I goofed hard with how I had it. I didn't think it was gonna make that much of a difference. It's ridiculous not having any moves. I guess now that it makes sense, not having any moves, you didn't actually have any moves because henceforth, not having, you know what, any moves. <laughs> But we're going to see some knockouts now. Even with this simplistic set of moves, it's only four strikes. You get two kicks, two punches, and it's only straights and jabs until you change the move and level them up upon leveling up. Oh, blocking is going to be a key attribute as well. Oh yeah, Dondre and Hithard get to fight after this. And then me versus the Mafia. And uh, anybody else, if you are still in here, uh, feel free. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> oh, we kind of all knew that was going to happen. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Well, there you guys go. There's your winnings. So Ricky, Dondre, Welch, and Sean Mafia with Asante Beast. Or no, Ricky was the winner. But yeah, Welch, Mafia, and a Beast with the winnings. Yeah, that plus seven strike, he definitely got you right there. Ouch. Hey, you still look at that cut above his eyebrow, though. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, Ricky left sad, but he's gonna come back happy. He's gonna find out that he won. Oh nice. <laughs> Sean, you actually you guys are on point that time. I, by the time I turned to see what that guy even said, you guys deleted it. So good good looking. Alright, so that's much better. Total strikes, the number was way down from last time. 
But one of you guys actually landed some strikes instead of the zero out of 185. Though all those pushes counted as actual strikes, which was ridiculous. But stun wobbles, of course, it took the one and then he finished it. And we're moving on to the Dondre versus Hit Hard fight. And this is going to be interesting. Of course, we're going to have Don. I went the wrong way. Let's just go up this time. Dondre Welch versus Hit Hard. Here we go. Let me go ahead and set up the vote for you guys. Let me reset this. Let me remove all these. So Welch versus Hit Hard. Welch is the first vote. Hit Hard as the second vote. You guys can start two bets. And uh, what's up with everybody tonight? Trying to promote their channel. I, I don't know what that is about, but uh, um, oh, it's bots. Yeah. Oh, streaming website. Okay, yeah. But let's see what you guys. Think's gonna win this. Of course, I gotta go with my nephew. I think Mr. Tryhard, Mr. Tryhard, Mr. Hithard is gonna win this one. We got two early votes for Welch here. Three early votes for Welch here. And one vote for Hithard by Asante Beast. And uh, Preston, if you do want to vote on your fighter again, if you are still here, you actually have... Okay, you can only bet 50. I kept it low at 50 because I wanted you guys to, you know, not waste all your coins on just one fight. <laughs> but there's Preston. Good, good heads up. So, what is the betting right now? We got three bets for Welch. We got two bets for Hard. And I'm going to give you guys 10 more seconds. I believe that's everybody, though. So, in about five, four, uh, might we voted for the wrong person, but looks like I'm going with the underdog. Oh, <laughs> sounds good. But we are stopping the votes. We are getting the fight going. Wait a second. Make sure I'm in the center here. Oh, I was on, I was on, I was <laughs> on the wrong side. There we go. I was wondering why uh, it made me choose the right shorts versus the left shorts there. But, uh. Here we go. These fights are going to be moving quick now. Now that we actually have things correctly working. We're still only going to do one fight for this episode since it took us so long to get things properly working. But, uh, oh, we finally got it going. Oh, yeah, I could. I could actual bet on you guys if I wanted to. Um, I guess I could. Um, but, you know, I'm, I guess, the founder. I can't. I guess I could. It's like Roger Goodell saying he's got a favorite NFL team. I don't know if he's actually came out and said he has a favorite NFL team, but it'd be like that. <laughs> Couple of you guys um, Dondre Welch and Sean Mafia, you guys are up at 187 and 155 points right now. And uh, I told you guys with the ranks, it's a leveling system. So you guys are up to level 5 in the uh, the stream chat. So you got a couple levels on everybody else. Behind you guys at level 5, second best is... Uh, okay, a couple people level 3 being Preston, Hyphy, Asante Beast, and then Punch, Ricky... At level two so of course we got the YTB series that you create a player you grow levels we got the YTB UFC that you create a player grow levels and then watching those two series of course we got the stream chat that you bet and you grow levels and uh, max level is level 30 by the way but to get there you got to get 30,000 points which is gonna <laughs> at that point I don't even know if you're gonna keep a hold of 30,000 points you might just start to bet your whole load <laughs> on fights at that point. But uh, I'm going to have to figure out who's going to be fighting after this, but we'll wait until after this fight because after watching Hyphy and Ricky, 
this is going to be a good one. Hyphy had a more balanced fighter, and he's going up against a, okay, a more pure striker. Um, this one's two hard hitting strikers, so it's all about who's going to get that cleaner shot, about putting one another on the ground. But I'm going to say Sean Mafia fights next. And we'll say he fights. Let's see here. Who do we got? We'll put him against Punch. And then we'll put Dragon Elite. Oh yeah, I'm fighting uh, the Mafia, and then his brother Sean Mafia is gonna fight uh, Punch Plays, and then Dragon Elite. I'm thinking about who and I want him to fight against. There's only one other person. I'm trying to think who it is. I know it's obvious. I just can't think of it right now. Oh, it's a Beast. Duh. My bad. <laughs> I was like, I know it's obvious. I just can't think of it. And that's everybody. Because that's five fights and there's ten of us. That's actually a good matchup. Because the YTV series, it's a quarterback versus a corner. And that's arguably the biggest rivalry. A corner's trying to take the ball that the quarterback throws the opposite direction. And you guys are going to face off right here. Uh, Preston, just one fight, which this is going to be your only fight for this stream since it took us so long, or took me so long to, uh, you know, get things properly working. But next time we stream the YTB UFC series on Saturday. Um, oh, that was a good... Oh, we pushing him back. Okay, that was awesome. But uh, we'll get two fights in, if not more. Obviously, if fights go as fast as they did in the first one, if everybody, you know, has round one knockouts... We'll uh, get, you know, two to three fights per person going. Oh my gosh. Preston is lighting him up right now. That's two wobbles. Oh, and a leg kick. He's trying to fire back. Good dodge. If you guys didn't know, Hitman, or Hit Harder, um, he's got a lot into his movement. His movement. Movability, movement, yeah, my bad. <laughs> um, so he's going to be able to keep up on other fighters and hit them very hard. That's how he wanted to build his fighter. And right now it's kind of proven to be a good move. Oh, no, until I... I jinxed him! Cover up! Cover up! Don't... I'm... I jinxed him! <laughs> I'm just going to be quiet. There you go. Stand up. Stand and bang. There we go. Alright. Back on their feet. Walsh is definitely trying to come back here. Oh, no. This is a crazy fight. Oh, my gosh. Obviously, his head is not recovered. He's taking shots. There's 15 seconds if they make it out of this round. I think they both just yeah they both just wanted to make it to the second round. They both got beat up. Oh man, this is gonna be a good fight. This is definitely not going the distance. I feel like this is an early round two finish for one of these two fighters. Yeah, right there, that was just bad by the AI, just instantly trying to stand up and not allowing his head to recover, so he just quickly got knocked down again. Yeah, I, ah, yeah that was a very even round. Welch got stumbled two or three times. Hard, hit hard got stumbled two or three times. Oh, man. All right, I, this fight is not making it a round two. They touch gloves. They know <laughs> they got to respect each other after this one. That was a phenomenal round. Oh, my Lord. 
Welch is terrified. Oh, got him against the wall. Or the cage, I should say. Oh my gosh, man. Oh, okay, that was a strong kick. Oh, he's wobbly. He's wobbly. Oh, those leg kicks, man. I'm surprised it's made it two minutes into the second round. I thought this was going to be like a 30 second knockout in the second round. This is so much punishment being dealt out. Oh, <laughs> these guys are going to be so bruised. Luckily this is a virtual game because these guys, it's like career ending amount of punishment. The momentum swings in this or the shifts tiding or the tides shifting <laughs> Jesus um, is ridiculous look at these guys just stand and stare each other down with respect that was a nice leg check oh nice straight Now they're not having these, the straights and jabs. Obviously nobody has hooks or uppercuts or overhands or anything like that. But the amount of power that most of these fighters have, it doesn't even matter. Is this somehow going to make it into round three? That leg is dying. Point bets for the NFL. You're talking about the uh, the Madden series, the YTV. But uh, yeah, there will be betting on those games as well. Oh my gosh! This is somehow going to make it to game or round three. Wow! How? That amazes me. Like, round one, I'm surprised anybody made it out. Round two is even more ridiculous. Is this somehow going to go to decision? Because I don't know how you... I don't know how you vote on who has won this so far. I feel like that round probably went to Preston. He landed a lot of leg kicks. He wobbled him with leg kicks quite a bit. And of course, those crazy knockdown punches. Alright, final round. I guess this is all about Welch winning a round to try to win decision. Or having to knock out try hard or I keep saying try hard hit hard to uh, get this victory or is try hard oh, god dang it <laughs> it's gonna take me so long to not say try hard hit hard I'm just gonna say Preston I'm just gonna say Preston it's gonna Preston has the chance oh my gosh knocked him down with a leg kick that movement is definitely paying off for Preston He's been able to duck a few of these shots, get away from him. And that's got to be messing with Welch's stamina until that happens. And instantly back up. And instantly. Wow. <laughs> oh, you think you hit me hard? I'm right back up. <laughs> Knock you down. Dude, these guys are gladiators right now. And his left leg is annihilated. Oh my god! 
that leg. I wish we were viewing from the other side to see how red that leg is. And the thing with Preston's character, we got oh, he just knocked him out with a leg kick. Out of all things to beat him with, he just knocked him out with a leg kick. That's the last thing I expected out of any of these fights. <laughs> oh, my. oh gosh. Well, there we go. Hit hard with the victory. There you go to the winners. Asante Beast and Preston. That was a good win. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called stop to this contest. At two minutes, 30 seconds of round number three. Typing in the next fight, which is me versus Mafia. Good fight to press, and that was ridiculous. That fight, you guys were, like I said, the amount of push punishment being dealt out was phenomenal. That was a banger. And then the way you won it by breaking that man's leg was the last ending I expected. Yeah, 12 stumbles between the two of you. Uh, you definitely landed more strikes, more significant strikes. It says that Welch had 26 seconds of control, but that didn't really make much of a difference. Oh yeah, you guys got a ton of knockdowns. Alright, so God Bear versus the Mafia. The Mafia. I'll go ahead and put the votes up for you guys. So we have... I have one better strike than him. He's got more health because I have zero in my toughness. But I have more into my stamina or my endurance. Because I made my guy a good striker in terms of power and speed. And then I wanted to be able to throw strikes pretty much indefinitely. At least over the other fighters because I knew you guys weren't going to focus on stamina or anything like that. So if the fight makes it out of the first or second round, or the further it makes into the rounds, that much better my fighter is going to be because I'm going to have more stamina is the direction that I went. <gasps> Preston voted against me. How dare you, family member. <laughs> no. That's, that's alright. I think you... I'll, I'll go ahead and say that you accidentally voted against me. <laughs> but uh, I'll give you guys a little bit of time to... Uh... There we go. I'm in the center. <gasps> Hyphy voted against me too. Everybody. I'm... Oh. Beast is the only one that voted for me. My feelings are hurt. It's God Bear with one vote. Mafia with three votes. <laughs> Oh no, Preston, you voted for one. A God Bear vote was zero. Oh, so you both of you voted for... Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I know you guys meant to vote for me, but you guys did vote for Mafia. Because a God Bear vote was zero, you guys voted one for Mafia. That's the only weird thing. The betting, why is it zero? It should be one and two, but... Eventually, we will all get used to it. But that is four votes. We are going to go ahead and stop the voting. Get the fight going. Good luck to me. <laughs> the Mafia, no good luck goes to you. I just want to purely dominate this fight right now. Hold on. Did it show? Let's see. Uh, wait. Oh no, yeah, it says zero God Bear, one Mafia. Alright, so I'm fighting another 
straight out of prison, fully tatted, purple haired, Barney looking <laughs> mofo. And I want to, he's a striker, of course. I'm curious what he's going to say about me. Probably striker as well, because we're both strikers. But, uh, oh, I just want to dominate. I want to do what Preston did to this man, but not get knocked down as many times, which I know is not going to happen. Actually, technically, it could happen. I'm going to get knocked down less times because I have less toughness. Because if I get knocked down at all, I'm probably done for. <laughs> It's a Barney Takashi 69, haha. Yeah. That hair though. Nah. The Mafia is probably our our most I guess expressive character out of all our fighters. The tats, the hair color. Actually, Preston's the same way. He's got tats and he's got blue hair. So both of those guys are the most expressive. Oh, if you guys didn't know, just give him 99 overall. <laughs> Hey, I'll give my guy 99 overall. But yeah, I went pretty simple with my guy. Just a shoulder tat with a forearm tattoo on my left arm. And then, uh, if you guys are wondering about the face, it's actually uh, Devin Hester's game face. <laughs> I'm a big fan of Devin Hester when he was playing, and that's the last face I apparently had from a UFC game a long time ago. It was, uh, wait, what was it? EAU? No. It was a, one of the UFC games. I don't remember which one. But I used Devin Hester's game face, and I was like top 50 in the world, and I loved that game. But I, bl oh my God, my reach advantage is gonna be ridiculous. I have a nine-inch reach advantage. That's huge. I forgot that you're 5'10, but I just chose a great matchup. <laughs> Obviously, I think you hit harder than me. You're gonna be harder to knock out. So I'm just gonna have to avoid your hands. And after seeing what Preston did, avoid them leg kicks. But my, like I said, my player is very fast, hits very hard. Not max at 100, but he has 90 speed and 90 hit power. But uh, I'm mainly focusing on being athletic and stamina. That's my thing. Getting out of the first round, which is counterproductive without having any toughness. But uh, is, like I said the better and better I get the further into the fight it goes but here we go we'll see if they're gonna touch gloves okay we did okay you initially wanted to touch and then <laughs> I was belated about it oh there we go I want to see those I'm sorry Ryan but I'm purely gonna just talk about my fighter and what he does well <laughs> but uh, what did you upgrade on my guy um I don't fully remember what the like the attribute numbers were, but uh, your brother let me know what you wanted, and uh, he kind of built it for you. And I'm hoping that you go down right now. This is this is my series. I have to win. <laughs> no, I definitely want to win. Obviously, if I don't, it's a bummer. I'll cry a little before I sleep tonight. But <laughs> best of luck to everybody that's in the series. Your movement is definitely higher than mine. Or at least you're moving or using your movement better than my fighter is. It might be because you're so short. How many more fights? We have two more after this one. Which is Sean Mafia versus Punch Plays and Dragon Elite versus Asante Beast. Throw them punches. Don't take any, but throw them. Oh, stop taking those shots, man. Get caught with my hands down. Use the reach. Stay away from him. How? Okay, good move. Good duck. Okay, your dude has got some very quick little getaway sidesteps. And apparently my strikes aren't making it through your blocking either. That was a nice leg check. I 
have to turn my lamp off. Oh! Did I just wobble you by checking your leg kick? I didn't think that was possible. Lay him out. If he's worried about his leg, make him worried about his face next. Keep him against the cage. Oh, yes! Unleash the flurry. Put him away. Put him away. Put him away. Yes! There we go. I'm happy about that. I'll take it. <laughs> I apologize, the Mafia, or Ryan Mafia. But... As my series, I have to win. <laughs> so, but, uh... No, that reach advantage, though, and me getting you pins against the cage was just worst-case scenario for your fighter. And... Oh, there was only one correct vote for my fighter. And... It happens to be a Sante Beast who gets a hundred more points. Yeah, Ryan, we can change you to Max after this fight. Or after the last fights. I'll put Max height as a, a reminder. And I'll underline it. Yeah, anything you guys want changed about your fighters? <laughs> it's time for his growth spurt, for sure. But now we got uh, Sean Mafia, your brother, versus Puck Plays. Alright, so Sean Mafia... I'm just going to type other Mafia, so Mafia versus Punch. Alright, so of course there was one wobble, which I was worried I was going to be the one that only got wobbled once and put away. I landed six more strikes and one more significant strike. Other than that, there was no time of control for either fighter. And we're going to quickly get into the next fight, because uh, we've definitely had plenty of time wasted trying to get everything getting going so i want to uh, get these fights going for all of you guys and of course next stream will just be just packed full of a ton of fights and phenomenal fights all right so we got sean mafia here versus punch plays do some of my coins go away oh no all your coins stay oh yeah all the coins that you bet um unfortunately being a wrong bet we're still a bet so if you lose the bet those coins you bet go away all right, so this is the matchup. Let me go start bet. So remember, the first fighter is a vote for zero. The second fighter being a vote for one. But uh, you see that Punch Plays, despite being a little chunky, has better health. And then Sean Mafia has better striking. So this is all about if the striking is going to be able to overcome the health. And we get a quick vote for Mafia. For, from Sean Mafia <laughs> voting for his own fighter. We get Asante Beast also voting for Mafia. We get a third vote for Mafia, this time by Dondre Welch. And then, I f there's your thing. I was like, well, eventually it's going to let you know how many points you got. And he bets, oh, Preston bets 20 on Mafia. There we go. So all votes for Mafia right now. And, and then Hyphy votes for Punch Plays. So one vote. So four for Mafia and one for Punch. And I believe that's everybody. So uh, going to go ahead in three, two, one. Stop the voting. Make sure I'm in the center. Get this going. Good luck to the two fighters. We're going to change the arena to the Honda, Honda, Honda Center. Jesus. And uh, get things going. We only got one fight after this, and it's Dragon Elite and Asante Beast, which should be a good matchup, of course, in terms of uh, fighters that are on my team in the YTB series. Punch Plays is my opponent in that Madden series. And then the next fighter, Asante Beast, is my teammate going against an opponent. So I think we might know uh, where my underlying allegiance lies there. <laughs> best for last oh yeah we'll definitely see I don't think okay there's no real incentive of voting fight of the night since you don't get any extra experience we're purely doing win a fight you grow a level lose a fight you don't you have to lose two fights in that way but uh, as of now 
I think Fight of the Night definitely has to be that fight between Hit Hard and Dondre Welch. That was ridiculous. The fact that it lasted three rounds and ended the way it did was ridiculous. So unless these last two fights can surpass that showcase, I think, you know, just as, you know, a title being given, that would be fight of the night as of now. The Sean Mafia's dude is just so clean cut. He just seems like a normal dude, a dude that probably, you know, wears a suit on his off days. Of course, <laughs> he's pretty jacked, nice and athletically built. And then <laughs> facing the complete opposite, a dude that probably wears sweats, currently, you know, waiting until he gets home to snack on some more Cheetos. <laughs> going to have a huge, another 9-inch reach advantage. Uh, Preston, if you want, um, what, probably Monday? Because tomorrow... I'm uh, going to watch the Super Bowl over at uh, Justin's house. Otherwise, just next time you got grandma's, I can go snag you and bring you back up here or do something. Alright, this is going to be a fun fight to watch. Less so on what they actually do, but appearance-wise between the two fighters. It literally looks like Frankie Edgar is fighting Roy Nelson. If you guys know who those two guys are, one, it's different complete weight classes, but <laughs> with how they look and how they're built, that's like the best references I can make off the top of my head. I said Frankie Edgar, but I meant TJ Dillashaw. Frankie Edgar's got brown hair. Dillashaw's got blonde hair. God, he's so much bigger than you. Like, the fact that he's got that extra weight on his midsection, because I had the same height advantage over Ryan Mafia, but I didn't look nearly as big as this dude. Alright, we have noticed or witnessed that being pinned against the cage or having your back to the cage is the wrong place to be oh yeah for sure Preston we can do either one we can play uh, games if you're with your dad or if you go to grandma's I can just bring you up here Pretty sure Asante Beast is gonna, still gonna be here because he's gonna want to watch his fight. Oh, Dondra's here too. Cool. Appreciate you guys sticking through uh, this very long stream that took a extended amount of time to actually th get things working the way they should have been from the get go. But uh, we finally got it going, and then. Uh, like I said, next Saturday when we got this series going, how it should have been, we'll be able to just jam-pack the next episode with a ton of fights. So regardless if you lose fights or win fights, you'll grow at least one level because everybody's going to be able to be able to fight two to three times in the next episode. Especially if you know we get a couple round one finishes. <laughs> Don Jam Salty picture here. Appreciate it. Man, you guys had oh, such just a gladiator battle, though. You and Preston. Oh, yeah, appreciate it, Preston. I think uh, your coin, or your I keep saying coin, your... <laughs> oh, my God, your points definitely show it. Yeah, over 100. And that's only going to build. Oh, 
Oh, okay, that was a phenomenal combo right there. And you are bloodied up, Sean. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that was a dirty head kick in the back of the head from the ground. And the end of the round. Wow, that got very bad at the end, but you managed to escape it. Now, look at the head kick. The dirty head kick. Oh, it's going to skip it. <laughs> I think that's the best combo we've seen all night. We've knocked me out, cool GG, but we fought our hearts out. And then, yeah, but with a kick, yeah. I didn't, I didn't even, I knew the game could end like that, but I didn't think we, as the YTV series, would have got an ending like that. And Sean is bloodied up right now. Yeah, Punch Plays definitely won that round. He tore up Sean. So Sean's gonna have to retaliate and come back with a vengeance in round two to win the round or just end it period but with how that went punch is tasting blood right now just a shock in water how is he throwing these double jabs he's the only guy i've seen throw those double jabs or at least that i've noticed nice leg check Oh, nice counter. <laughs> For a big guy, Punch plays, he's got these little quick little jabs. He fits them in there. Oh, that was a nice little dodge. Got way out of the way. Good leg kick. Those have obviously proven to be quite deadly <laughs> throughout <laughs> this, today's fights. Oh, we got that one through the block. Oh, Jesus. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I was about to say. When you get knocked down against the fence, there's no one, nowhere to really go. Oh my, there's only one of you that voted for Punch Plays too. And you are the winner. Alright, so Hyphy <laughs> with the win. With the betting at least. Oh man, so that kind of shows that striking isn't everything. If you can withstand your opponent or just get better shots in general, you can easily win some fights. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving. But again, I could say reverse as well because I have nothing in my toughness, but I was able to land strikes before that was any sort of problem. Alright, so all five wobbles go to punch plays. He, of course, two of them being knockdowns. He landed one extra significant strike, 10 extra total strikes. And we're on to the last fight of the day between Dragon Elite and Asante Beast. And then everybody that won their fight will, of course, be able to put five attributes into their fighter as well as choose uh, either a perk or fighter move. But I'm pretty sure everybody's going to be going with a fighter move um, from what we've seen. Uh, can you make me six feet tall after this? Oh, yeah, for sure. And then Asante Beast. All right. So here we go. We'll look, let you guys look at that. Remember that it's always zero and one until we get used to it. So starting the betting, you guys see that striking is about the same. Dragon Elite has a two bump in striking, but then Asante Beast has a three bump in his health. 
Oh, go Rams? Oh, yeah, for sure. But yeah, Sean, you want to make your guy six foot even? Or six foot even? Jesus. Losing my capability of speaking at the moment. <laughs> yeah, Preston, I can definitely make you 6'6 six, six as well. Let me, uh... Uh, right here. 6'6. Six, six. Sean Mafia said 6 foot even. Gotcha. 6 foot even. I'm just laying that. Just making side notes on the notepad so I can remember. And uh, right now, we got all four votes for Asante Beast. No votes for Dragon Elite. <laughs> Good night. Oh, see ya, Sean Mafia. Appreciate you stopping by. And I believe that will do it for the votes. Uh, the only person that has not voted, I believe, is Preston. So, Preston, if you do want to make a quick vote, a head kick also, since I won my fight. Oh, yeah, for sure. We'll definitely get you a head kick. That's going to be nasty. Right now, that's going to come out of nowhere once we actually get those going. Oh, yeah, I'll wait for you, Preston. So, remember, zero for Elite, who has zero votes right now, actually. And uh, four, currently, for Asante Beast. I'm going to go in the middle. Actually, I'll just go left so you can still look at his attribute points or their attribute points. Oh, and he votes for Dragon Elite. All right, so we finally got a vote for Dragon Elite. I'm the best fighter YTB. <laughs> and then Justin's here. Yeah, Justin, you're... Hey, why are you voting Dragon? No. <laughs> for me. All right. Here we go. We are going to change... Dang it, I clicked X way too fast. I was going to change the arena, but it's all right. Last fight of the day. Got to stop the voting. Votes are in. One for Elite, four for Beast. And uh, Justin, we can definitely get you created for uh, the next YTB stream as well. But right here, I'm curious to see what the height difference is. I know Dragon Elite is 6'5". Asante Beast might be 6'3". I don't quite remember how tall you were. But this is the fun part where members from the YTB Madden series who are on opposing teams will also have a grudge when it comes to the YTB MMA series. And <laughs> it's going to be fun. All right, what's I gonna say about Elite? About the same thing. Of course, it's gonna say a lot of the same things. Wait, does everyone get an upgrade? Um, besides the people that lost. Because the people that lost get half a level. So people that are not getting a upgrade, unfortunately, is Hyphy because he won his first fight. Dondre, you will unfortunately not get an upgrade. But regardless, next episode, even if you lose another fight, you will get an upgrade. We'll probably do two or three fights. So even if you lost your next three fights that are going to be in the next episode streamed on Saturday, you would get two levels um, and then the Mafia doesn't get one. Sean Mafia doesn't. And then one of these two fighters here will, of course, not get a level. But uh, that is undecided. They get to choose. I do gotta say I like how everybody's fighter, okay, almost everybody's fighter, looks the same as their YTB Madden player. So everybody's got two jobs right now. <laughs> and everybody competes in different ways. 
and you can smack talk in different categories. Maybe one of us is going to be good in the UFC series, but you aren't in the Madden series. And then vice versa. Could be good in the Madden series, but you get your butt kicked over here in the UFC series. A lot of leg kicks being thrown around. A lot of leg kicks being thrown around. Mainly from Dragon Elite. <laughs> Next Saturday I'm going 2-0. Don't at me though. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping to do the same. See, that's going to be the big thing. If any of our fighters go on big undefeated win streaks, the fact that I'm allowing everybody to challenge one another, you can try to ruin, you know, an undefeated streak. Seeing who really is the top dog. Don't leave it up to chance. Go out there and challenge somebody you don't think is better than you, despite having the same or better undefeated record, or just better record in general. Oh yeah, Dondre, I'll definitely go at you next week. Oh, nice leg check. Ooh, with a nice little combo to follow it. Alright, Dragon League got off the cage. Throwing a few jabs. Haven't seen him throw that right hand too often yet. Oh, okay. Very nice straight. Oh my gosh. He wobbled with a, with a leg check. Speed and defense. Oh yeah. I'm probably going to put some in my toughness next time I grow a level. Not today. I think I might go more movement or more power. I'm not completely... Sure. I'll have to wait until I actually click into my fighter and look. Dragon Elite is in trouble right now. Not only is he hurt, he put himself up against the cage. But right now, Asante Beast isn't fully pursuing him, keeping up against that cage. And that is the end of the round. All right. Dragon Elite, I think your player eased off a little bit. Let him out of that round. I think that one would definitely go to you. <laughs> Merciful. <laughs> oh, yeah, hey, how's the uh, the stream quality for you guys? Is it? I think it's 1080p. If not, it's at least 720p. I believe the latency is still good between you and me in terms of responses in the comment section. Still trying to, you know, perfect the stream. I feel like I got my settings pretty good right now with a mixture of how good the uh, video quality is and the latency between responses as he once again quickly wobbles him. Unless Dragon Elite fights back here. 1080p, 60 frames per second. Very nice. That's what I was hoping for. Oh yeah, Dondre, you... Hey, your dude, despite losing, put on a hell of a show and definitely proved that he's nothing to be messed with. You... You wobbled somebody five times. <laughs> you and... Oh my god, I was going to say try hard. You and Preston wobbled people the most you just happen to fight each other and <laughs> you know getting knocked down five times is nothing slight of a miracle or yeah I'm not mind. you got knocked down seven times you knocked down Preston five times but right now oh my lord Dragon Elite was wobbled but then he knocked down <laughs> Dragon or no Beast was wobbled 
but then knocked down elite. I'm trying to do like multiple things at the time. I have my uh, <laughs> browser open. I'll close it so I can focus my bed. Oh, is uh... <laughs> Looking at uh, Sean Mafia's comment, trying to write down the wide receiver that he wants to make. And then Ryan Mafia is going to be a kicker. So we got two new members for the uh, YTV Madden series. But uh, right now I'm going to focus up on this last fight. Is once again a leak getting knocked down. Okay. Oh, Lord. That was a bad, bad kick. We, might have, we know this is a worry now. Them leg kicks are nothing to shy from. Okay. I think this can go either way right now. This just got interesting. Both fighters are in danger. Mainly Elite right now. Or mainly <laughs> Beast. And a little bit of wrestling out of all things. And full mount. Uh-oh. We have yet to see full mount. But you might be able to escape it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, I was about to say, Dragon Elite's trying to show that he's more of a man than a Santa Beast, but he was able to get up. And drop him from a leg check. Ten seconds left in the second round. Okay. Oh, that... All right. Oh, Preston, you got to leave? Okay, no problem. Uh, I'll let you know who wins this fight. I'll text you. But uh, right now, again, another banger that makes it to the third round. Yeah, that was scary. Both of you. Dra or Beast, you got... There was a good, probably full minute that you were just getting punished. Like the multiple leg kicks that were knocking you down. 2.67 hours. <laughs> yeah, this... Yeah, it's right now we've been streaming for two hours, forty-six minutes, and forty-five seconds. But again, a good hour of that, if not more, was probably just trying to get this YTV series set up because I downloaded the game today, tried to get the stream settings all set for it, and then of course rushed through the player creations and didn't test the fights without having any move sets which we had to have basic ones just so they can actually throw strikes instead of throwing pushes at the opposing fighters. Oh! Okay! That wasn't even a leg kick. He just broke that man's leg with a leg check. So, he was not even the one that threw the strike and TKO'd him. Okay. Alright. I'm happy for you, Beast. We're teammates on the Chicago Bears in the Madden series. I'm happy you won this one. That's ridiculous. Look at this. He goes to kick you because he knocked you down however many times before. Besides that time. Regretted it instantly. That was underwhelming, but I'll take it. A little bit. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario but we'll pick the winner, which is Beast. Unfortunately, Preston was the only one that voted for Elite, and it didn't quite pan out. You guys got quite a few coins. Or I'm definitely changing it, changing it to coins. I keep saying coins, so I'm going to change it to coins versus the points. Just because... Watch, I'm going to change it to coins, and then I'm going to keep saying uh, points. I doubt it. Coins is just... It's the fact that I'm playing Anthem. The currency in Anthem is coins. So it's stuck in my head. It's probably going to be the best thing for me to say, because I'm going to continue to say it. But uh, both of them had two wobbles, three leg health events, which ultimately ended the night for Dragon Elite, two knockdowns. Dragon Elite had more strikes landed and more significant strikes, which he tried to throw one of them significant leg strikes, and it ended his day. <laughs> and <laughs> good fight, good win.
That was a close one for sure. And now we're going to uh, go edit a couple of fighters and then we'll get to improving the fighters that won. So first we got to change hit hard to six foot six because he wants that reach advantage. So general, he goes from 6'3 to 6'6. Six, six. And he did win, but he's not in the stream now, so I'll wait to uh, talk to him tomorrow or I'll text him and uh, find out where he wants his attribute points. I know he said he wanted a head kick, but uh, I'll try to best let him choose exactly what head kick he wants. And now we're going to go to Sean Mafia really quickly, change him to six foot, and then Ryan Mafia wants to be six six. And then we'll get to the victors of the day and uh, improve on our fighters. So yeah, so he improves by two inches. Not a huge bump, but it is. Night Dondre, appreciate you watching, especially for how long this lasted. To all of you, much appreciated. Love all you guys. And again, next episode is going to be so much better. Happy wants to be 632. Okay, you can be 265 as the max weight. But we can definitely make you 63. But real quick, we're going to go to this man, make him 66. Okay, he's going to improve by 8 inches. <laughs> All right, now real quick, I'm going to go to my fighter and make him just so you guys can kind of look at the, the moves. I'll kind of showcase through my dude. And then we'll go to Hyphy. We'll go to, okay, Hit Hard's not here, but, okay, Punch Plays isn't here. So, yeah, we'll go me, Hyphy, and then Feast. You want Lesnar stats. Res Lesnar is a wrestler, so you want them wrestling stats? I will give you wrestling. St I just clicked the wrong one. Watch you be the wrestler and everybody just knocks you out before you take anybody down. Alright, me. I'm happy with how quickly this game loads into the fighters. But where do I want my five stats? You know what? I'm going to go power. I'm going to go 95 power. Wait. That puts me up one striking. Okay. So that puts me up there. And now I want to move. No fake WWE. <laughs> Alright, what do I want? I can either make one of these level two. See, it gives you stamina cost reduction. Like down here, it's 15% less stamina reduction and 14% more damage. But I'm going to leave it at level one. What is this? Is this an overhand? No, it's a hook. I want an overhand punch. That's what I want. See, lead overhand. That's what I want right there. I'm going to go ahead and give myself this at level 1. I want that. No, I want my right hand though. An overhand right hand. That's what I want. Level 1 overhand right hand. What's the haymaker look like, though? Ooh, I think that's faster. Yeah, I'm going with the haymaker. Haymaker level 1 seems a little bit faster. That's going to be nice. I'm going to get that to level 5 as quickly as I can. I'm going to lay everyone out with that. <laughs> so that's my level and my move that I'm putting into my fighter. We'll go to Hyphy here. I don't know what my first one is going to be. Oh, next weekend. Oh, who do you want to fight? I got you. Uh, Hyphy, do you know what you want to your five attribute points? Oh, the Stockton slap. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hyphy didn't win. Not bad. It was Ricky. So we'll just go to... Uh, I have both your name, you and Ricky, circled. So my, <laughs> my bad. So it's not the beast right next here. So a beast, do you know where you want your attribute points or what move you want added? We can go through the moves and I'll, of course, go and look at your stats here. 
You already got 100 power. You could go even more strike speed, more accuracy, blocking, head movement, footwork to make you faster. You see it increases speed of movement, steps, and lunges. Uh, grapples, I doubt any of us are going to do for a long time. Fitness, of course I did, but nobody else has done yet. Which I didn't get to showcase too much because I beat my opponent in the first round. Um, you already have 50 in chin, body, and leg. Which I'm kind of happy I did 50 and everything because I actually felt bad giving some of you leg strength but it's definitely something that you guys what the heck that should be 40 I want to see my stats after oh yeah much for doubt no doubt but uh beast if you want to let me know where you want them oh he said night so he's not here whoops I just saw that I didn't see him say that. What well, we dropped is overall a little bit because I didn't knock that <laughs> last stamina down completely. It was at 40 instead of 30. Which it's toughness and heart. It wouldn't have made that much of a difference but anyways. He didn't get knocked down and actually punched upon. That's when heart and toughness actually comes into play. But we will look at your stat typhi. And then we of course will end the stream since we're about to close in on 3 hours. Alright, so I did my stats. Alright, so your stats right here. So you got, you said balance, so we got 60, 60, 60, 50, 50, and then we got 50, 30, 30, or, or just 50. So if you want any of these changed, we can. Like if you want less accuracy, more power, uh, less footwork, more power, etc less chin if you wanted less chin we can change anything if you wanted to just let me know because I will edit your player and then we of course will end the stream oh I think you're letting me know oh just send you a pic of those okay I got you <laughs> already dipped all right, no problem. So it didn't change anything. So, yeah, that's going to end the stream. Of course, this lasted way longer than I thought it was going to, but we got everything set up. The next stream is going to be so much better. Cut all of that extra wasted time and just straight just straight jump into the fights with the fighters if we don't gain any more of them than the 10 members that we currently have. But everybody that was in here, appreciate you guys stopping by. Deuces. And until next time, everybody, Godbert out.